Good evening, and welcome back to the third episode of Cuttlefish Sweepstakes. As always, we would absolutely love it if you could like this video, subscribe to our channel, and check that bell so you never miss an episode. What would be really awesome, in honor of this miniature villain-esque arc that we're playing, is if in the comments below, you told us who or what is your favorite villain of all time? Ooh. Below, in the comments, let us know. In the meantime, if you'd like to help support the channel, you can do so by checking out our merch shop, where we've got a lot of brand new awesome Crooked Moon merch and brand new Legends of Avantress logo merch. You can join our Patreon, where we've got a really great brand new campaign coming up in January. And lastly, you can pre-order your copy of The Crooked Moon at thecrookedmoon.com today. Thank you. And we're back. It's day three of the 43rd Grand Fleen Flell Prime Material Plane Championship brought to you by Everwood's Emporium. And boy, oh boy, things are really heating up as we enter the semifinals. Yes, it is. Or is that yes, they are? Unclear. It's another beautiful day in Goodberry Square. I'm Tank Hammerfall, and coming up are the Thrycreen Dream Team versus the pubescent freakish Samurai Turtles. The team that wins today will be... The team that wins today will be facing off tomorrow against the Grung Hopportunity Seekers. You know, these team names have really gotten out of hand ever since the mighty trunks came onto the scene. You can say that again. Any other thoughts before the king's whistle sounds, Verrett? Yes. For years I've sat here with you, watching game after game of Flameflell, and all this time we've been saying the sponsor of this championship is Everwood's Emporium. But to be honest, I don't think once in all that time have we ever described what it is they offer. That is an outstanding point, Verrett. Let's take a minute before the game to describe Everwood's products and services in graphic detail. To begin, I'd like to start by recommending my absolute favorite item, the... Hey! Wait a minute, you can't be in here. This is the announcer's box. Yeah, get out of here. What are you doing? Stop this right now. This is preposterous. I see that you know your judo well. Get your hands off of me. I'm not about to... Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, help for being... This might be your best one. Right? They just keep getting better. Welcome to Cuttlefish Sweepstakes. <laughs> Cuddle what? Sweepstakes what? That's right, Verrett. I'm told that today a little more than three dozen strange souls will be vying to survive in a deadly competition for the entertainment of the very clientele that so <coughs> kindly requested our presence. Yikes. Uh, finally, some good fucking entertainment for once. <laughs> yes, I'll take a double shot of red spider whiskey and a bowl of lemon wedges on the side. Thank you. Verrett. These people are betting their very lives for a chance at godhood. They could die at any moment. The prize may be grand, but at what cost? I'm not here to pass judgment. Let's call them as we seize them. Fair enough. Well, coming up next is whatever nightmarish slaughterama the powerful organizers of this gauntlet of death have planned for our brave contestants. Brought to you, uh... Yeah, stay tuned, folks. This is Cuttlefish Sweet Things. Enjoy! <laughs> Gotta give it up. Bravo! Gotta oh, give it up for the announcers. Gotta give it up. I see you know your judo well. You really got me. Oh, man. That's probably the, the best meme on the internet. Uh, the five of you reassemble in the dormitory, and uh, for the four. Oh, yes. The four of you reassemble in the dormitory. Um, Jean-Claude, you are shocked and horrified to see that Felpip is not among the few uh, returning back to the dormitory space. You see Glitzy there. You see the walrus. You see Babar. Familiar faces. But Felpip is absent. Well, I say, I say, I say, it seems we're one man down. Where is, uh, is Felpip on his way? He's on his way, all right. <laughs> to hell. Wow. <laughs> How did you say that? Because when he joined me back to back in the middle of that arena, I told him <coughs> I would see him there, one way or another. Well, I mean, think of all the times we spent together. Those three days in prison. I do. I hold them fondly, and I'm sure he is dancing on the corpses of the damned in one of the nine hells. Well, it looks like everybody else made it. Is that the case? Yes. 
We're more or less in one piece. Nothing of value was lost. How did you survive? Well, oh, that is a trying, trying story. John For Clyde. another time. <laughs> you have, you may be covered in tremendous amount of bruises, magical scrapes and, and uh, scratches, uh, uh, maybe blood coming down, trickling from your ears. You also had in a fight in, a, in an arena, an arena that slowly shrank over time, uh, uh, having this um, like deadly light and only this increasingly small area to survive in. Only four people of the original people, uh, uh, ten that went in there, survived the onslaught. And you can look over and see the uh, uh, pale faces of the, uh, uh, the shocked faces of the people who are uh, were fighting with you, and then finally managed to escape with you uh, as the four of you cuddled in the final zone before the um, rest were all either destroyed, uh, uh, basically um, uh, disintegrated by the red light, or um, killed during the combat itself to, to fight for that limited space. Well, it was a terrible experience. So horrible, I couldn't possibly bring it to words. I'm sure you understand. Did you... Kill a man. <sighs> yes, yes, I did. Oh, well, no. allegedly. Uh, oh, yeah. Unfortunately, I hadn't realized the game hadn't started yet. Uh, so, you know, that was awkward at the time. Poor <laughs> 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 Velvet. I tried my best. It's all right. He died doing what he loved. Well, not quite. There weren't any woods or teenagers. <laughs> there was no one to lure. There were no souls to feed to the great cloven one. No so, so he more or less just died. <laughs> not just died, it was disintegrated. And his soul was slurped through the air into that horrible treasure chest. Oh. What's That's the, a good point. What's the point of any of it? We have to wonder if the souls of the damned are not trapped in there forever. They probably are. The chest still hovers, almost slowly rotating in the air, just above at the very top of the uh, dormitory. Um, you are free uh, agents in this dormitory, in this space, to sleep, to get food, to uh, uh, enjoy the um, few amenities that uh, exist within this space. Um, you've noticed that uh, even um, conflict is not something that the showrunners seem to care about, but the few attempts of folks trying to get up to that chest by flight or teleportation or any form of deception have been immediately put down. At this time, the chest simply just rotates, crackling with nefarious energy. And this is what we've come to understand is the, is the prize? This is the prize. At the end of each game, um, there uh, the chest will open, and um, you can see spirits getting pulled into it. The lives, the very souls of the other creatures who have perished in these games. Uh, I'm gonna go <laughs> eat 32 egg salad sandwiches in his honor. You would eat that many. I didn't know they were letting D-rate supervillains into this competition. You turn and you hear this voice. Uh, I am uh, presuming that you are also perhaps getting some food and have a plate of whatever Dr. Poison would be most interested in. A plate in, of poison! In, uh, in consuming. Um, what does Dr. Poison look like as the group turns to hear this strange voice? Dr. Poison is, uh, is, is wearing a comical doctor's outfit mm -hmm. straight out of Spirit Halloween. <laughs> With big rubber gloves. Do you have one of the like classic masks, or is it like a, a, a just a smaller like mask on you, like a surgeon's mask on your head? Do you have like a cap? Uh, one of those giant like metal discs at the, Ooh. At the top. Right? Maybe a stethoscope. I look like Doctor Doofensmirth, <laughs> but a snake man. <laughs> and I make my supervillain lair underneath the jungle temple themed mini golf course. <laughs> <laughs> hey! <laughs> Who the fuck 
superior than you are. I think I'm superior. <laughs> Super villain around these parts. Spit it down! You fucking loser! Spit it down! <laughs> the walrus feels threatened. <laughs> There's only room for one villain related to animal theme crime around here. <laughs> Too bad. It's, but you are correct. And it will be me, Dr. Poison. What do you think, guys? You just kill this guy right now. <laughs> you certainly could. His accent is annoying. <laughs> nice try. I saw that little fucking freak of nature <laughs> try to steal my thing with the snakes while I was also taking a shit in that snakes, which actually was set up in the last session. The foreshadowing was real. That's, that, that's definitely what happened. Uh, oh. Little did you know I sabotaged him. I poisoned his lunch. So he would be an idiot and get killed hit by six fireballs. Oh, you heard about that? Oh. News travel. Rest fast. in piss. <laughs> oh, it was mostly friendly fire. Oh. Well, I'm gonna go drown my sorrows in egg salad. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm gonna go to the cafeteria. Clearly uh, moved by the death of Felpip, the walrus makes his exit. <coughs> the little freak microwave <laughs> <laughs> salad. Oh. What a freak of nature. I know that we don't know each other very well yet, but yeah, that was pretty weird. <laughs> I admire your bloodlust. Thank you. And I admire, I must say, even though the walrus threatens me based on our turf, I like his bloodshed and it was he who partially killed the freak of nature. <laughs> it's true. There were lots of magics flying around in the last competition. But you must know, the walrus did his best to try to save Felpin, more than any of us did. The little freak got hit by all of it. <laughs> <laughs> or I name isn't Dr. Poison. <laughs> well, if only you had been there, a real, a real genuine doctor. You could have saved him. I could have saved him from life. <laughs> 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 Anyway, do you want any egg salad? No. Good luck with the next competition. Psych! <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Poison starts to make his way towards, uh, back towards the food table, and you can oh see God. that there are a few others. They actually get out of his way, a little intimidated from what they witnessed, his abilities being what they are. Um, <coughs> Though they were among the survivors in the previous competition's room with Dr. Poison, they uh, very clearly um, uh, know that he's no one to be trifled with. Is there anything else that you want to do before you rest, before you sleep, before you uh, thinking on uh, the next day's potential challenge, whatever that may be? What do you think? Should we, uh... Well, I say, you, you mean, uh, the doctor? Yes! Well, I, I don't want to get in trouble for it, and I mean, it seems like, uh, the wheel's spinning, but the hamster's dead. <laughs> well, that was pretty good. That's actually very funny. <laughs> Glitzy, would you back me up on this? <clears throat> back you up on what? Sorry. K killing Dr. Poison! Oh, I don't want to go anywhere close to him. Poison and bombs don't mix. They don't? <laughs> Here's the thing, the walrus. You're right to fear me. <laughs> Numbers are dwindling. It will not be long before we are for forced to turn on each other. But until then, we might yeah. be able to find him useful. Or what we could do is just turn on him now. 
I like that idea. I thought you were against mixing bombs and poison. Yeah, in a friendly manner, for I, sure. I think the time may present itself where we can proverbial, proverbially use him as a human shield. Oh God, it looks like a bunch of chickens were just delivered to our homestead. <laughs> What? A hatch uh, in the ceiling opens up, and all of a sudden, <laughs> fifteen chickens. <laughs> fifteen buffaloes. I, I, was there, I, was there. I told you not to come to work. <laughs> they begin I said, I told you to I never visit out. me in the total fifth <laughs> <three days. laughs> Not one time. Let's take a minute and, and get some chicken wings. <laughs> oh, oh my God. What the fuck? You awaken, having enjoyed a long rest. Um, the dormitories are uh, quieter. Um, there are far, far, far fewer people, and still the same number of beds, effectively. Enough beds for perhaps four or five hundred, and now there are but forty people remaining. You're starting to realize that you're getting more and more familiar with <coughs> the faces of the few people who have this rare chance of surviving the cuttlefish sweepstakes. Um, Dr. Poison being one of them. Uh, as you uh, awaken, you enjoy a breakfast, and you realize very quickly you're being corralled into uh, into groups. And uh, sticking close to those that you know most of all, um, the, the uh, four of you find yourself uh, sort of partnered, already teamed up with uh, Dr. Poison and five others as you are grouped into teams of 10. <gasps> I need to access the battle map. Oh, Ooh. It's gonna be rough. I'm gonna I'm take sorry. another break. My apologies. <laughs> <laughs> teams, teams, of, teams of eight. It won't be hard for me. Yeah, yeah, it's it's fun. Fun. I kid mostly. Oh, I kid somewhat. Fake. <laughs> oh, and I don't have. Um, I found three of the bottle caps, but I don't have. Uh, uh, for some reason, I'm not. I don't have two more bottle caps for the other folks. I can grab some, but I don't know where the others went that we had previously. No. It's gotta be on the table, right? Wait, so what is Dr. Poison exactly? It's you on I mean, it's you on T, but tea. what, like? Artificer. Artificer, okay. I'm so the worst class. <laughs> yep. I don't know what a Dr. Doofenshmirtz is. I'm a, like a mad scientist from. The context. Is that, is that a picture of platypus? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I don't like this, Derek. Except, I mean, I, you know, I have a lab coat. Oh. Is this like rope tug? We played no, we did that we played, last week. We played oh, tug of war. Really? Yeah. Oh, let's. We played uh, tug of war in Fortnite last session. Can can we uh, battle map it, Andy? If we just show what the folks yeah, with yeah, Derek's yeah. doing here. So you can see there's four squares, three squares, two squares, and then an indeterminate number and of squares. And then infinity squares. One square and oh, then an indeterminate square. number of squares. Infinity squares. So we'll see how this shakes out here. Nothing like this. Avoid. This will be like the start, yeah, and then there's a dotted line up out over here, so we'll I'm sure, we're gonna be sliding around. All right. Uh, I would like to everyone to note that I'm just shuffling these. Oh God. Oh, oh yeah. I love shuffling. shuffling. Uh, we're gonna go over under what? a little Oops. bit. Uh, yes. Just shuffling these. They don't like that. And oh. they'll go one. I, I say, I say, I was eloquent the whole time. The whole time. <laughs> I was also not an elephant. I say, I say, I say. <laughs> that, that old elephant was dealing with whispers and shadows. <laughs> Certainly not me, a proud Salt I, I have always been of the eloquence. If you think differently, you've not been paying attention. <laughs> Speaking of TV tropes, a bit of a retcon. <laughs> a retcon. Oh, I'm going to look up types of TV tropes for retcons. A retroactive I, cannon, I, I say, I say. That's okay. Don't worry about it. If we don't... Recorder, strike that from the record. <laughs> oh. Dang. Interesting. This is like the glass one. Alright, so you can figure out movement. I'm dude. sure. Very confident. I love Mr. Beast. Uh, let's just put them on the lines. That's the way to do this. Sure. Oh, and we had a long rest, so I can't. We did. This mm -hmm. is not a touch screen. Yeah, don't. 
<laughs> smear chicken all over your I'm screen. Not a, not a I'll say, I'll say. <laughs> I'll say, I'll say. I'll bring me the one nights like that. Home alone. <laughs> Jesus. Too many whiskey sours. That's so fucking gross. Too many whiskey sours on a nice summer day. Smearing chicken across the screen. Ignore the smear lines. Oh, fuck. Oh! Hold on, hold on. Let me move that. Awful. They're Absolutely fine. Awful. Yeah, slightly, fine. slightly. Uh, and in case you need this, that's there. All right. Uh, you guys all need to start um, putting yourselves one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight in one of these eight positions. And in addition to the five of you, there are three. I'm still the walrus. Dr. Poison will never should we, lose. Should we I roll be, for a position? I want to be third from the end. Which end? <coughs> end closest to Andy. Okay. Right there? That's, this is the third position from the end. One, uh, two, three, four, five, six. I'll put an NPC here, an NPC here. I'll be far away from that blubbering idiot, the walrus. <laughs> Uh, oh, do you yeah. get it, blubbering idiot? Sure that we didn't we'll fucking spend, kill you! <laughs> you were spending all session eating fried chicken. Oh, yeah. I don't know where the... Well, food. this is delicious. <laughs> I'll, I'll say, I'll say it's 13 herbs and spices. <laughs> <laughs> it tastes better because of my scent. <laughs> well, I'll um, say, I'll say it's fried surprise. This can, be, this can be you, Dr. Poison. I'm just oh, assigning Dr. it to you. Oh, Dr. Poison. Rhodes. Uh, who are we missing that doesn't have a uh, Jean Jean Claude? Jean Claude, all away from that idiot, the walrus. You can be a red uh, chickeny fish thing. Oh, okay. It's a little bit of a tight squeeze. A red here, but... chickeny fish. Yep. It's good enough. Yeah, it's good enough. Exactly. All right. Oh, uh, hey, Doctor Pissin! <laughs> <laughs> you, you fucking free down there! <laughs> Um, mechanically. <laughs> That's right, they have my favorite trope, the enemies to lovers, between the walrus and uh, Dr. We'll see what happens. <laughs> there can be only one mini golf course. <laughs> Super villain layer in golf course. I'll show you lovers. <laughs> yeah. You better not survive or I'm gonna fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Standard movement rules, this is a grid, five feet for each square. Um, and uh, each one of these is sort of like a, um, uh, there's like a moat that goes across and these bridges that uh, mm. are very, very clearly are magical in some way. And that's true Ooh. for all of these spaces. These lines are poisonous it, moats? Uh, the lines I put together uh, are the moats, yeah. That's Is okay. it relevant how you have, like some of these are going this way, some of these are coming to the horizontally? Um, no, I, th this is just so that you can't go around. Right, like he means the orientation. Means the You're gonna have to go through each of these. He means the orientation no. of the note card. It doesn't see how so the, so the orientation like doesn't matter. When Got you it. flip them over, that you'll see that they have words on them. And oh, we must okay, cross okay. these bridges. You oh, must okay. cross the bridges. It Can't would be cheat. extremely obvious to you that attempting to go through would mean falling to your death. Um, and that would be true at each one of their uh, moat threshold. And there's an obvious finish line. Uh, on the fucked. So it's a, this it's is a, it's fucked. A oh, Can I fly over the moat? Uh, you would guess that you could not fly. Oh, fuck. <laughs> you picked the worst race for this, Sean. Oh, well, oh. well welcome back, Sean Claude and the Ponte. <laughs> it was me all along. I was just wearing one of them giant chicken suits. <laughs> 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 Peter Griffin! <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Ten Peter minutes too long! <laughs> Peter Griffin's in Fortnite right now. Oh, oh my God. freaking sweet Lois! Yeah, it's science on the tail! <laughs> Lois, look, I'm in Fortnite now! And he's that reminds full. me. He's full for no reason. <laughs> it um, reminds me of the time that. Oh, and you're all lit up, God, and you realize that in, in, at any moment, this energy shield uh, directly in front of you is going to drop, and you're going to have to make it from one end to the other in order to uh, survive. But the nature of the actual competition um, as still eludes you. Why? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. Um, you can hear announcers for the first time. Uh, what? What is this game exactly? I'm not sure exactly what these uh, 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 portals, bridges. Uh, uh, what, what is the nature of the game? 
I'm being told that the uh, uh, there will be challenges within each pocket that we'll have to cross in order to get from one threshold to the other, and that they're going to be quite challenging. Oh, okay. Well, uh, uh, does that mean that they all just have to make it across in order to get through the third? No, it's just the first four who get across the finish line. Everyone else is going to die. <laughs> oh, well, oh, that's, that's very serious. One of Half of them are going to die? <laughs> yes, half exactly. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! <laughs> oh my god! Okay. okay. I need everyone to roll for initiative. I say we break Dr. Poison's <laughs> legs. <laughs> Dude! <laughs> Oh my god, this is not a touch screen. I might twist wow. this. I'm gonna use I'm gonna use three dread. Thank oh, you. Oh shit. I'm twisting. It's because I used the wrong guy. Let's use this. Alright. Uh twenty to thirty. Nice. Is uh is initiative an ability check? It's it's dex. Yeah. It'll be plus four. It's gonna be a plus four de- initiative. Yeah, yeah, I'm just asking if it's an ability, it's an ability yes, check. Yes. I'm going to use my reaction to bend Dr. Poison's luck and take a 1d4 <laughs> away from it. <laughs> oh. This is savage already. Dr. Poison woke up on the right. wrong side of the bed. <laughs> the... <laughs> Thank you, my Thank you for explaining Wow. <laughs> yes, it's an ability oh, check. Wow. 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 wow! Minus four. <laughs> Unreal. Oh no! I'm feeling a little molasses <laughs> uh, Give me that molasses 15 to 20. Oh, I got a 21. 15. I got a 21. By 17. 17. 17. Oh, shit. So Walrus and John Claude both beat that bar. 17. Uh, I go first! <laughs> roll off. Fuck! Yeah, roll Just off. Just hi- sure. highest, highest uh, number on a d20. No twist. Oh. No, no twist, probably. No, 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 just roll up. Sure. Yeah. John Claus in it, baby. I got a 15. Oh, you did. Uh, that's is this the new thing. initiative, or is this just like you know? This is the initiative that we're going to race in. Is that does that answer your question, uh, Doctor Poison? What did you get? I got an eight. <laughs> <laughs> that's amazing. <laughs> Well, you, really you knocked him here. down two full spots in the, in the, in the race. Well, I say it looks like Dr. Poison has been found guilty. I'll be in a bit. Uh, <laughs> oh, 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 Slightly. <laughs> Aside from teleportation and flying, this there the are no rules to use your time. abilities. Um, but I will note that it will require your action to engage one of the challenge squares. <laughs> this means sword. Sorry, can you say it one more time? Uh, Sorry. Th- no teleportation, no flying. It takes an action to enter one of the ch- challenge squares. So you can't just dash. Uh, and uh, well, you can dash if you don't. You want to have an action? That's what I'm well, saying. Well, you, you, you wouldn't have an action, but like if you wanted to go over left or right, or if you wanted to stop and mm-hmm. use your action to cast something to uh, sure. uh, stop the others or something along those lines. However, it, there there are no rules except for those mechanical things that you should be aware of. And top of the round, Glitzy, you are up. Uh, I am going to go straight forward and use my action on the one in front of me. Okay, uh, you reach it. Uh, go ahead and flip it over, and you can flip over the adjacent ones as well. Whoa, really? oh, cool. Performance. Oh, you lucky duck. Intimidation and acrobatics. As you get closer, you get a sense that these are challenges that uh, uh, once you enter um, will have some sort of relevant skill or ability that you might be able to use. Um, do you continue to jump into performance? Um, I will jump into intimidation. Damn. Okay, uh, she uh, reverts. Jumps over there. Jumps yeah. over there. And you jump into the portal. Shoom. All of a sudden, you turn around and you realize that the space that you're inside of is uh, temporarily, temporarily, temporarily out of sync with the race. You have unlimited time in this in this uh, domed space because turning around, you can see all the other competitors racing forward are frozen in time. You look forward, Ooh. and there's a you're inside of a room. 
and right in front of you is a massive doorway, and before it stands a massive, huge guard with this giant fuck you mace with all these spiked barbs on the uh, the side, huge spiked uh, 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 pads for armor on all sides, rippling with muscle, and he's standing there. If you can scare me, you can go through. Um, I'm gonna look towards him and my, um, or as I'm looking up to him, my eyes start to cross and look in different directions. Um, because that's what happens when I look up at Rich. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and he's the biggest man I know. Yeah. Um, and I'm gonna, oh, God, you're so Okay, we're done, we're done. so big. He's keep very him. tall. Um, and, uh, I'm gonna look up at him and I'm gonna say, um, you may be big and strong and have a mace, but when you're melting, you're smaller than a fairy. And I'm gonna just like illuminate with fire. Oh. Go ahead and roll an intimidation check. Natural 20. Oh! 28. 28. I use my lock to subtract 28. <laughs> <laughs> the guard, the guard oh, lurches forward for a moment and then <gasps> withers and wilts and that's pretty good. He steps to the side and he invites you to try to pass through the portal. Thanks a bunch, friend. See you on the other side. And you just skip on the way through and you arrive on the exact adjacent square. If you still have movement left, you can use it at this point, but you've used your action to pass uh, through the threshold. I have one, two, three. I think like, what, I have maybe one space of movement left. One, two, three, four, five. Now you're, you're, so you, you got here, right? Well, I right? didn't get on to performance, right? It was right in front. Yeah, you, you, you would still have, like, square. yeah, I think you'd be out. Okay, yeah, one, I'll stay one, there. One, two, three, three four, four and a half, five and a half, six. Yeah. yeah. So crossing the other threshold, you look around <laughs> and you realize that if you wanted to make a perception check to see what is uh, mm-hmm. the most immediate uh, uh, things do. in front of you, you'd be able to do I that. I do. Uh, I'm not very perceptive, though, so I don't think. Perception, you say? Uh, a sweet eight. A sweet eight. Uh, uh, you're just glad that you made it past that guard without a fight and uh, blinking. Um, John Claude, go ahead and make a perception check for me. Fourteen. Fourteen. Uh, I would say that is not enough for you to perceive the challenges directly in front of you. You would have needed a 15 or higher, but uh, uh, you turn and you realize that that Glissy has made it through her threshold as well, and that the next, the the two of you are at this time uh, uh, in the lead. Walrus, you're up. Do I get a sense that I can teleport as long as it's in the realm of the game? Like I'm not cheating to like get ahead? It's like teleporting within this rectangle. You do not know if it's teleportation would be cheating to get to the challenge, or if it would be teleporting cheating to get across the threshold without going through the challenge pits. You're not sure if you'd be punished for one or the other, or both. That's a risky, risky maneuver, as we saw when we <gasps> moved banana slits. I'm hoofing it! One, <laughs> two, three, four! Yeah, there's nothing stopping us from going through a portal that someone's already been through? Nothing stopping you. Okay. I'm right no. up. Ah, ah, ah. Ah. I say, I say intimidation, Your Honor. <laughs> you uh, uh, jump, uh, spending your action, and land. And directly in front of you is this huge doorway. And it uh, filling the frame of this doorway is this massive, muscle, um, uh, muscly guard, uh, breathing heavy. If you can scare me, I'll let you pass. Get the fuck out of my way! You're not going to let me launch the doctor pigeon! <laughs> Just make an intimidation check. This is the greatest rivalry of all time for us. I'm twisting. Nothing, nothing will stop this. This is so good. I fucking love this rivalry. 27. This was a shit That's enough. There? You pass oh immediately through. Yeah. Oh, so can, do I occupy yeah, this next to each other? There's chickens five. underneath the clucking moon. I'm sure I would it's say fine. if you land on the other this side, is, you have to move left. Uh, no, oh I'm totally out. Okay, God. then you get displaced. Um, I would say that you bump into Glithy and bop to the side of okay. where you are now. Perfect. Go ahead and make a perception check for me. Oh, no one can perceive shit. Natural sure. one! Okay, <laughs> you, you, you all are shocked by that strange temporal displacement experience. You do not have an idea, a sense of what challenges lay before you. Babar, you're up. Uh, I'm going through the intimidation portal. 
15, oh. 20. Okay. Uh, you see the same thing. You jump through, and for a moment you realize that uh, Glitzy and uh, the Walrus are in front of you, already starting to make their next moves. You see Jean-Claude having just bopped out on his side. Looking behind you, you can see the others are all starting to race towards additional challenges. There's a door in front of you, and in it, a massive, towering, monstrous creature covered in armor looking to crush you with its uh, massive mace. If you can scare me, I'll let you pass. I fear no man, mortal, construct, or god. And when I ascend, I will be back for revenge. Make an intimidation check. I got a 14. I'm going to twist it. I'm Good, gonna call. Twist it. Good call. Good call. Because I, I got a high plus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's going to be a 25. Ooh. 25 is enough. You are able to pass through. Oh, oh and when you ascend. Oh, 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 oh. And uh, you are able to uh, 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 walk through the door, and you find yourself mm -hmm. landing magically on the other side, bopping to the right of Glitzy. Um, mm. as you, oh. So all of this land is fair game. These lines are more just... They were initially guidelines that I wanted to just make sure that you guys didn't try to go around the challenges. Okay. You could just consider the outermost challenges as sort of the limit. I see. The limit. Got it. Mm. Perceive? Yes. 18. 18. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, go ahead and put the money. two nearest to you. Yeah, yep, exactly that? right. Animal handling. Medicine. Oh, jeez Louise. Just for curiosity, would we have seen what this one is, too? <laughs> Since we all walked into the intimidation door? Uh, one yes. Extra? Yes. Ooh, nature. <laughs> <laughs> That's what Dr. Poison is. Not good it? for that bar, let me tell you. Um, oh, man, you think this is just every one of them? There's not a single repeat? Probably not. Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah, Which yeah. means we're going to have to just force our way through. Uh, uh, this one's going to attempt to go through the nature door. Are you following his movement rules? It matters. Every square matters. You're right. You're right. Where do you, you start? Just, you can't just kind of hand wave it, Derek. One and a half, three. Yeah, 20. 20. Okay. Oh, so we right? do 10 after 15, that. And then... If he gets through, do we still have our movement after we leave the board? Yes. Here. Well, I thought only the first four off the line survived. No, no, no. First one across. Oh, through across. at the end. Oh. Then oh. I'd be fucked. Um. Uh, I have a twist of thread. I'll use it. Good enough. Uh, this uh, uh, half elf is able to pop out to the other side. It's fucking half elf. It's always half elf. Unsure, <laughs> unsure what exactly it was that they encountered. Uh, the next one, closest to Dr. Poison, is going to go 5, 10, 15, 20, and use his action to go into the one next to Acrobat. This guy? Yep. My hands are very shaky. I don't know why. I apologize. Uh, what are we looking at? Religion. 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 Sorry, I should have read it out. Uh, it pops in there, and uh, what happens inside the challenge uh, is opaque to those watching from outside. You have no idea. Um, but they don't succeed, and they bop back and find themselves in Whoa. front of religion. Was Same he, spot or one square back? Same spot. Okay. When somebody goes in, is it like an instantaneous like? Yeah, it's like no yeah, time yeah. to ha okay. like. It's like if you jump uh, in, cool. all of a sudden you just find yourself yeah, yeah. on the other side. To of this us, massive it's immediate. Move. Right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Doctor Poison. Oh, there's only one that hasn't been revealed yet. Do you dare? <clears throat> I suppose I could dare. Go, go, rock'em, sock'em, rock'em, poison boots. Activate. <laughs> and I'm going to use my special rocket boots to bonus action and move 15 feet. Okay. All right. Is so that, is that so teleportation is or is this a... Uh, let me, let me I see. I just what, want to make sure that it's not like Misty Step or something. Uh, if it is teleport, I'm not going to do that. Yeah. Just in case. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Try it, you coward! <laughs> hey, do we know if we can do it? We don't. We don't know. We haven't tried oh. it yet. Oh, so I thought you just tried it. No, no I decided to play so. He's a fear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a feared. Uh, <laughs> I am a feared. Uh, I'm you sorry. Ah! Oh, is it more chickens? Always. Chickens! <laughs> there we go. Sorry, and sorry, sorry. Fire back up. Yeah, yeah. yeah fire it. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. We did this for like chicken. six uh, okay. well, it's all, really, well, it's all family. <laughs> teleport. About it. Oh, it is a teleport. teleport. Okay. So uh, you want to try it or no? I'm going to try it. Okay. You attempt to teleport 15 feet, and all of a sudden you feel yourself <laughs> locked in uh, to place. Uh, you imagine that if you had tried that farther up the field, that you would have been bopped back here to the start line. <gasps> <laughs> you should have told no. him that, that would have been hilarious. 
Oh. That's good. I'll just walk you with my sneaky legs. Uh, and I'm going to look uh, look at this guy, and I'm going to just go straight. I'm going to say. Oh, you want to go to religion? I'm going to go to religion. I'm saying your mama don't dance. He, and, was still, he would still see it though, right? So we know. Oh yeah. I'm going to religion. You uh, hop in and you realize that in this space, time is frozen for you. You have all the time in the world uh, before returning to the heat of the race, before returning to the heat of battle. And uh, you, you look up and you see that you're in almost a church-like space. There are empty pews all around you and you walk past uh, uh, many lit candles before you reach the center and there's something of an altar there at the, f uh, uh, the center begging for an offering. And looking up at the stained glass in front of you, you see that there is a symbol, a symbol of a gear. Make a religion check for me. Hmm. <laughs> I am a very, I may be a super villain, but I am a godly man. <laughs> oh, 14. Pretty good. 14. That will be a 22. Nice. Oh, wow. Pretty uh, good. 22 is just <coughs> enough as you uh, realize oh, hmm. gear, uh, gear item. It's uh, one of those is... god steric likes to use. <laughs> and uh, uh, reaching down, you realize that uh, uh, all one needs to do for the offering is, is, is put down any kind of simple tool or uh, craftsmanship. I've got plenty of those. I'll produce my... Uh, I'll, saw. <laughs> I'll produce my thing longer. <laughs> you pull the thing longer out. My mechanically, it's going to be my... Uh, Fucking more tools. I have a million tools as a fucking. Can you get a chicken? Yeah. Uh. They'll be thieves' tools. Okay. You pop the thieves' that tools down, and nice. You pop them down, and all of a sudden, the light illuminating through the stained glass window gets brighter and brighter and brighter until pop, bam! You find yourself on the other side of the threshold. Because I went straight, I can move up a square. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Oh. <coughs> We're staring Mace. Um, and I'll look over and I'll say, Look what the cat dragged in! <laughs> 5, 10, 15, 20 to acrobatics. Oh. I don't think that trim can stay in. I'm going to use a twisted stomach. thread. Uh, more than enough. Gets, uh, gets the other way. And he also can use an additional space of movement. So wow. he'll pop forward like this. Great! Uh, you find yourselves all along the line, and Felicity at the top of the round, you're up next. I am going to. Oh, I'm oh, sorry, the my side. apologies. Dr. Poison, make a perception check for me. Oh, Dr. Poison has poison in his eyes. Fuck. <laughs> I st Stop rolling on the battle map! <laughs> oh, fuck. Now roll uh, elsewhere. Is your total 15 or higher? Uh, it is a 19. I think it was a 15 here. Uh, and yes, you can flip over these two uh, closest to you. Mm. Wonderful. <clears throat> Just so that Glissy has all the information that she could want. Okay. Ooh. So what do we see there? Perception, deception. Fuck. Uh, how far away it. is the deception? Far. Probably not that far for you, but. Can I make deception? If I have thirty, it's it's more one, than thirty. One, one, one and a half, three, four, five. Yeah. 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 yeah okay, there we go. I'll go to deception. You can barely make it. One and a half, three, four, oh, five, okay. six. Yeah. yeah. You uh, f uh, jump in, and all of a sudden you find yourself in this strange sort of hazy space. You realize you're you're in some kind of a ziggurat or temple, but in front of you is uh, uh, a, almost like a monstrous um, stone creature, like a sphinx almost. And it turns to you, its eyes flash and flare and, glow, and glowers down at you, and it says, If you can lie to me, I will let you pass. Oh, look over there! <laughs> Make a deception check. <laughs> I'm gonna point and just... Twenty. Twenty. He, it looks at you and does not look to the side. Instead, its eyes grow brighter and brighter and brighter, and, and uh, it uh, looks at you and says, 
I understand that was a deception, which means that you have failed. And all of a sudden, this beam of light flays your skin off. You feel this steaming could I use hot a twist. I'm just I mean, yeah, you could have. No, no, I'll let Glitzy die. Okay. All of a sudden, you get hit and you ignite into oh flames. You feel this terrible experience as you are scorched, beamed, uh, 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 crushed away, evaporated and destroyed, and then reassembled behind the line of the first set of challenges. <gasps> You're Holy bopped shit. all the way back to adjacent to the NPC on Mixed Religion. So just straight back. Straight back. <laughs> you are suddenly sh- uh, shoved back by the challenge and cool. you find yourself one level back. But oh, whole, but despite dead. your terrifying, You're not dead. terrifying oh, I was experience. Literally, I, was so, I was so ready to pull up my next character. <laughs> but still whole, despite Not your ten. terrifying experience. Oh my god. John Claude, you're uh, you have a movement and bonus action left. You still have the remainder of your turn if you want to do anything. Um, no, I think I think that was the full of my my movement, so okay. I'm okay. John I'm Claude. concerned that I physically won't have enough to get through some of this. <laughs> I twist until you succeed. If I not, if I only if have the, plus one, it's like twenty totally something. Oh. You know what yeah. I mean? Can I can I perception check what this is and still potentially go to the deception? Oh well, one? yeah. Shouldn't the one next to the deception be open? Yes, because I walk past that. Yes. Mace, you're crushing the head of a chicken. Oh. Um. Oh. oh my God, that was made for John Paul John and, uh, and everyone should know this about the game. I started with a high DC, and it will steadily get down, uh, lo- reduced by one every round refresh. So oh. if there are, if they're like, okay, if we're all yeah. failing, yeah, I thought, I thought that. That makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna go in the fucking like, chicken. I swear to God. To the <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah. You yeah. the no wonder I've been sick. Okay. <laughs> God, I'm getting hit by asbestos ceiling. Well, I'll see if I can persuade the mighty guardian of this portal. Oh, Son of fuck. a bitch. <laughs> oh, fuck, it's a space with laser eyes. You're jumping into deception or? Persuasion, my good Persuasion, goodness. my good That's what I was born to do. Yeah. Um, you uh, walk into what is very evidently a courtroom and a uh, uh, judge stands uh, uh, honorably at the very top of the, of the, there's no audience or anything, there isn't uh, any um, defendant, uh, nor are there any accused, there don't seem to be any jury members, just you and a judge, and you can walk up past the sort of hallowed wooden uh, 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 seats and put passing the bar, you walk up and the judge speaks down to you and says, tell me, why should I let you pass? Well, your honor, it seems you found the great Jean-Claude Chanticleer on your docket. And uh, you should let me pass because, well, you are employed by an evil cabal with many heads and not even a judge is above the law. (laughs) And that means that come someday soon, or maybe not at all, you will need legal representation. And I am the best in the land. Take my car. <laughs> he starts to reach out, make a persuasion check. Oh shit, the beef just dropped! Take the beef to John Claude. 24. 24 is yeah. enough. He takes the car. <gasps> That's very convincing. And he allows you to pass. Uh, he hits his gavel, and all of a sudden, blinking, you find yourself on the other side of the, th- uh, the, other side of the threshold with the remainder of your turn. Uh, I think I moved diagonally again. You were here, right? Yeah. One. Well, oh, is, yeah. Is there a, does it cost any movement to go from here to here? I think you get that one or for free. Or is that free? I think you get bumped, bumped for free, right? Um, yeah, once you are adjacent to these two squares, you would use your action and bop to the uh, to the other side. Okay. So where That's did you why start? I, really fucked up the map. I was I'm outside fine. of performance. Yeah. So he moved so to one, one and a half. Down. One and a half. Two and a half. Two and a half. He still has two and a half. Yeah. So you can move, you know. Can I, if I move in between these portals, can I attempt mm. to see yes, what they are? Yeah, be able to see them without a perception check. It's really for Three and a half. Distance. Or, and you can make a perception check to see one of the edge cases if you wanted to. Uh, well, I'll just see. Can I see the two in the middle and yeah, then make a perception check to also? Okay. 
insight. <laughs> Sean Connor has to defend him, represent himself in the edge what game. If you want to make a perception Arcana. check for one or the other, you may. No fucking way am I going to Arcana. Ins no fucking way am I going to Insight. Uh, I'll try the the one closest to Babar. Okay, uh, make a perception check. <clears throat> That's you. You want to twist it? No. Don't, don't twist okay, it. I, have a, I have no war chest. Save your stone. Um, the walrus. How, oh. No, it, it, unless you have more. Well, I was thinking maybe I just move over here to see what this one is. Oh, yeah, sure. I think if you have enough movement, you have. Uh, you have. What, you can do one more. One more. Because you're three and a half, and you're you're an Iron Crow, so you can only go four and a half. Okay. 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 Um, yeah. <laughs> you know, I would say you're just out of range to be able to see the nature of the challenge I'll within. See. And uh, I'll say, damn it! Th that being the conclusion of your turn, the walrus. You know where I'm going. One and a half, three, four, five, to deception. Ah. You find yourself in a strange uh, a ziggurat temple somewhere deep within some kind of a tomb, and inside there's a stone creature. Its eyes glow and looks at you, and you hear her words, lie to me. You've got to let me out of here. My oldest friend, Dr. Poison's out there, <laughs> and we got to make it through. We were roommates in the Guild of Villainous Intention. And we gotta see through to the end! I don't know what I'd do without him! He lost his up to yours. Deception Unbelievable! Uh, I'm convinced. I'm twisting? Yeah. Yeah. You gotta. Much better. 15 plus. Do you think 23 is enough? It's gotta be, right? Yeah, 21? I, I, do. I, do. I think that's I, I got 20 in that field. Oh, you got 20. But last I got 24. Round, the last round, 22 made it. So I think the DC's gotta 20. be 21. I think it's 22 or 20. It's probably I'm 20. gonna let yeah, 23. I'm safe. I'm gonna well, let 23. He said, 23 he, he said, he said each round the DC smart. goes down. Okay. 20 so if 22 made it last round, 21 had to make it this round. 23. You may pass, oh. and you oh. well find yourself uh, I think there's a group behind my back! <laughs> Son of a bitch! <laughs> <No>. <laughs> the, the statue would know that, being able to detect lies as it does, um, uh, in order to make sure that you are good at deception, and you were, so you successfully so get I've to the other side. one more square, I'm just gonna walk up here and okay. look at this and one. And you are able to see inside there. <laughs> oh, fuck athletics! I for the walrus is a Viking. No. Bavar. I want to make it to deception so bad, but I'm short. If if I use dash, that is my action. I can't go through a portal, correct? That's correct. Yeah, I gotta go through for persuasion. Uh, you got your charisma. Three. It's fine. It just would have been very funny for me to get through deception. I had a really good idea. <laughs> uh, what do you jump into? Persuasion. Persuasion. You find yourself walking into a courtroom. You've seen the inside of courtrooms before, but never as a lawyer or as a visitor, uh, other than to have judgment be cast down upon you. Has a strange feeling being in this space, but walking up, you realize the judge is waiting for you, and not someone uh, to, to give you a sentence, but instead to hear you out. Why should I let you pass his words echo through the room? I, Baba, have been here many times before. And never before have I been allowed to speak. I have done many evil things, but I've done them in the name of my family and my brother. Nothing, nothing will stop me from bringing him back from his tragic fleeing flow accident. <laughs> and I will not allow anyone to get in my way. Do you believe that makes me an evil man? I say not. He considers your words. Make a persuasion check. Pouring out for Rebab. <laughs> well, I say that's exactly why I never no, put twist. him on the stand. Okay. Twisting. Oh, I'm twisting again. Okay. I'm twisting again. You can keep letting her rip. I get a bazillion. I got a plus a bazillion here. Come on, one good roll. 
Much better. Nice. That's going to be a 23. That's oh, enough. Oh, no. Nice. Pack okay. uh, onto the other side and landing, uh, find Ooh. yourself blinking, staring at uh, the um, uh, walrus <laughs> and Jean-Claude. You do anything else with your turn? One and a half, three, four. Uh, yeah, I go five, six this way okay. towards athletics. Oh. And that's my turn. As I'm passing behind the walrus. One, 2.5, um, I uh, use my five. reaction to uh, <laughs> twist bent his luck. So it's next uh, <laughs> Really? No, no, I don't. Okay. Uh, animal handling check. Whatever happens in there happens to that particular soul, uh, but they do not succeed. And Oof. they flop back to the uh, space just next to Intimidation. Yeah. Uh, the other one uh, that is uh, that did succeed on its way through, um, was it uh, acrobatics that I made it to go through? Uh, I think so, or religion. Uh, we'll make its way towards. I think it's religion. Twenty twenty four so Toyota. There's, <laughs> there's perception, deception, persuasion are the closest to him. Medicine's kind of far. Uh, unfortunately, I think he's going to go for medicine because of okay. his abilities. Two, three and a half. Yep, three and a half. It's not going to be good enough. Get the oh. back. To performance. Yep. Brutal. And uh, the other one is going to continue uh, to try religion again. Makes it through. Uh, one, two. So you can make it all the way up. Yeah, I'll just have him go up to. Um, Deception or uh, there's also perception. Uh, I think perception for that one. He's gonna go like here. Yeah, yeah. Get right, get right in front of Doctor Pisson. Poison, I should say. Doctor Poison, your turn. I'm gonna look at him. Get in front of me. Yeah. <laughs> Yikes. Did you know that entropy is the poison of existence? What? <laughs> <laughs> you must swerve. Stop <laughs> spitting all over! Stop spitting on me! As from my hand, there'll be a big doomsday device, and I'm gonna cast Vortex Warp. Okay. Oh then. my god! And I'm going to attempt to absolutely heat him back 90, as far as I possibly can. Basically, the start line. The start line. Great. I'm gonna try to beat him back to the start line. Okay. Uh, what do I have to do? Uh, Constant saving throw. 16. 15. Uh, <laughs> space is twisted around him. <laughs> Stop spitting on <laughs> 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 Wow, fuck! <laughs> you suck, Dr. Poison! <laughs> I'll get you, Dr. Poison! You are supposed to suck a poison wound. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> nobody nobody walk, enjoyed I'll, that. I'll walk up here and I can't get in. Correct. Uh, oh, because you used I your use action, action to fuck him I up. I my action. Puts you more or less secure to like a closer spot, yeah, which is I pretty interesting. A, I got a closer spot. Um, and so that is my that is my turn. I don't think I can use my bonus action for anything. Okay. That's incredible. Uh, I think the only guy who didn't go is this guy. Mer no, he got zooped back. This yeah. guy didn't go, right? Yeah. No, that's the one that tried animal handling and got bopped back. Oh, that is just the vortex warp guy? Is this vortex warp? Is that me? I thought he was No, he ran in front of me. So one of these guys, it has to oh, be this guy. Oh, it's the guy who's on top of performance. Performance, yes. Performance. He's going to try to go to performance. He got zooped back from going to medicine. Last round. Last oh, round, yeah. Right? No, I thought that just happened, but that's okay. I should be doing a better job tracking this. I'm just something I'm as a game master. Um, <laughs> it'll be him. He's going to try for performance again. Uh, I'm going to twist it. The minus chat. And he makes Oh, and they're saying it's Vortex Warp guy's turn. It's, war it's Vortex Warp guy's turn? There's, but how is he? How did he no, get he in just moved in front of him. He yeah. just moved he in front just of him. That's why I thought it was this guy, because he just got warped back from the medicine check. Oh, yeah, I think it's the guy on the far right. Did he move at all? I thought he failed last turn. Yeah. Uh, okay. We'll let's say it's that say, guy. Let's say it's Intimidation guy. I'm going to keep my roll, and he can make it through. One, and... Where would uh, you like to go? He's going to try animal handling on his next turn. Okay. 
Uh, can you move him one to the left? Yeah, you can. Yeah, absolutely. Play an optimal A over here. Glitzy! Uh, I can't. What's in front? Acrobatics, religion, stuff. Uh, Glitzy will do acrobatics. Okay, so you can just go. You don't have to move at all. Get up here, Glitzy! We need you! You can do it! Uh, acrobatics, you say? I don't have you in any way! <laughs> <laughs> I don't have any cool business cards. You suddenly pass through, and again, time is frozen all around you. You turn around, you see the chaos. You see somebody being vortex warped, mid warp. It's very uh, uh, chaotic and uh, uh, strange to see as Doctor Poison uses this deadly weapon. You um, turn and you realize how unstable the hallway you're staring at is. As you stare oh. down, uh, there are a few lit torches. It's very dark but you can see that the tiles uh, that are um, in front of you to walk across are, are going to require a very dexterous movement, otherwise the ceiling might collapse upon you at any time. All right, well, I guess it's time for some cartwheels, and I'm gonna start cartwheeling across the platform. <laughs> and I'm going to twist. And I'm gonna twist. That's why we got them. And I'm gonna twist. Brutal. That's okay. Oh. Keep going. Oh. Keep going. You got him. Spend him. You had the most starting off. I know, and I'm gonna twist again. Oh. No. Which one? Are you it doesn't work. You should have the first one, though, right? Yep. Well, she just don't go anywhere. You might be lower. I, I haven't rolled above seven. Oh. Are you out of twists? No. No, no, no. What? But what is it for? Acrobatics. I, 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 I think you should keep twisting until. I think the game wants my new character. Okay. I'll do one more twist. Come on, one more. We need your Glitzy! 16 plus 7. Yes! 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 So 23. Let's fucking you, go! Uh, uh, do a, a cartwheel, and uh, you realize that the ceiling is collapsing on you. You do Thank another you, uh, uh, cartwheel. You realize the ceiling is just behind you, Indiana Jones style, like a boulder. It's like that, but you maintain focus on your uh, acrobatic ability, and by the time you reach the other side of this uh, hallway, you are narrowly dodging the debris falling all around you, but you do succeed in bamfing back to the outside and back into the race. You can more or less and pick I whatever can, one you want here. Yeah, I can, what, what are those Perception, options? deception, persuasion, medicine, and then animal handling's all the way at the end, but. Deception, deception. Probably yeah, deception. Persuasion, persuasion then and, medicine. Yeah. Uh, yeah, deception or persuasion, either one of those. Either five, one, those are you can go five. right to deception. Yeah, I'll go deception. Okay. Uh, Jean-Claude. Uh, can it, are these lines like big, are these like, like They represent like barriers? barrier moats. If you were to try to go through, you feel like you'd either get sucked down or fall down into some horrible lava or something. It would be a nightmare. Cool. I'm imagining like lasers, instant death, like a bunch of spy lasers. You don't go across. through the portals, instant yeah. death. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and real quick, we got a lover's rose, Inky Mama, and Rip, and Rip a wild for the twist. Yay! That is just enough Yay! for a distribution oh, right here. Oh, distribution. Well, refresh. I love a little refresh. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Chad. Thank you, Chad. Uh, you're, you're up. Well, I say, bad boy, if I've told you once, I've told you a thousand <laughs> times. When you get in the courtroom, you gotta stop admitting to your crimes. <laughs> uh, can I That's you, uh... meta knowledge. <laughs> <laughs> As I flip you off and catch your card. Yeah. Uh, I've drawn on it. It says, uh, it is a uh, get out of jail free card that is written. I didn't do it. Yeah. Uh, and I can't give you bard inspiration. Thank you. Um, is it a D8 or D6? Uh, D8. It yeah. has one of those like Monopoly style illustrations yeah, of the yeah, bar, yeah, but yeah. he's being held up by yeah. an invisible hand, and he's like. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I would actually like to go to the very end and see what the unrevealed square is. Oh, I say, I say, one, two, three. Oh, you're okay. like, you're fishing for something here. I'm proud. Investigation, I oh, say. I say that's where no. you has a cross oh, I'll examination. Well, I'll say that, that no, in fact, I've never done the investigating. <laughs> oh. I've always left that to the detectives. <laughs> Oh, insight? Okay, I gotta figure oh, out which one I'm best down dumb. here. Oh. I mean, here's the thing though, right? Is like, even if your plus isn't that high, if you spike a good roll, you might get the. Yeah. Well, the, that's investigation. Yeah, they're basically all int. Right. Except for you may as well strength. troll. In yeah. I'll, I'll try. In, oh, int strength. Dr. Poison. Investigation. 
You, uh, feeling a little more hesitant, a little less confident, you, uh, jump into, through and into the space and land on your feet. You find yourself looking at a massive room. Uh, oh, that's intimidation. What's Sorry, the first one? one? Hmm? That's athletics. athletics. Per Arcana. Arcana, Arcana insight. insight. Let's slap it on the big cam here and slide up a little bit. Yeah, we don't care about that stupid guy. Yeah, stuck. that guy who's dumb. Uh, you pop into the space and you find yourself in a relatively small room, but one that is very busy with things. This feels like some sort of domicile, a, a, a place where someone lives. There's bookshelves, there's a, 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 a desk, there's a, a, a number of um, uh, shelves with all kinds of jars and stuff on it. And on the opposite side, you can see that there's a, um, uh, a, 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 on any side, there are no doors that would get you out of the space. This seems to be in a totally enclosed space. And then looking up is when you hear it. <laughs> the ceiling starts to come down, massive and, and uh, unyielding in its crushing. So you realize you have almost no time at all to figure out how to stop this wall from coming down. I say, oh fuck! <laughs> uh, I whip out a notepad and written on it, you'll see clues with a number one and nothing's filled out. Uh, <laughs> Incredible. Uh, uh, all the evidence is in front of me, I simply need to put it together, and the case is solved! <laughs> I mean, I'll attempt to investigate the room to find out you how You start to. putting the clues together like a good detective. I don't write anything. Paul Rose style. <laughs> You're not writing, but your eyes are scanning, just yeah. putting and piecing these things. Make an investigation check. I love escape rooms. I say, I say, a great bachelor party activity. <laughs> <laughs> I say you had all, twists. All twists. And Cannibal Porpoise, thank you for the twist. Thank it's, you. Starts the next chunk here. The next distribution the chunk? The next distribution chunk. Alright, it got worse. Hey, you can go again? <sighs> Do it one more time. One, one more time. One more time. On the time. big boy. The big boy. The white now? No. It's, it's not meant to be. Damn. You uh, uh, get desperate as suddenly bookshelves start to uh, uh, crush and collapse. You see uh, 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 art on the wall, paintings get knocked off and fall to the floor. Uh, you start to realize that you're having to duck down as you start to look behind things, anything. Could there be a lever? Could there be a button? You pull the rug back, there's nothing. And you realize that time is out when you cramp into a position where you no longer can search it's the at room. that moment I see on the bookshelf, the, the, <laughs> rind, the, the spine of a book that says secret recipes and I'll say, oh no! <laughs> but only your fingers can barely touch the binding as all of a sudden, John Claude, you are crushed into nothingness. You feel the force of your body uh, uh, explode out in a very unpleasant oh experience to be crushed to death. And then, bam! You are pushed back uh, to, yeah, you're pushed back right next, next to, him. to uh, John oh. Claude. Yeah, yeah. Um, set back in your race to uh, survive. Would he be right here, perhaps? <laughs> Just to give you a bit more option. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's fine. <laughs> um, the walrus. Oh! Oh! I don't know what to do! Um! <laughs> Indecisive <laughs> as always! <laughs> Get out of my head! <laughs> oh, I guess inside! Oh. One, two, three! Uh, Action! Uh, you jump into the space and you find yourself in a tavern. Uh, looking around in the tavern, you can see that this is uh, um, uh, patronized by all sorts of characters. Uh, there are two scholarly gentlemen over at one table debating about something. You see the bartender. You see uh, a hooded figure in the corner uh, smoking a long pipe. You can barely see the shadowed face. You see uh, the bards are all playing their instruments in one corner. Uh, uh, there's all sorts of different um, uh, people enjoying this tavern night. And you realize that just a gut feeling only one of them can show you to safety. Oh. 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 <laughs> I'm glad you do this voice. <laughs> 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 
was going to say this. I have all, if I have all the time in the world, I literally spend an hour doing that, like yeah. stroking my walrus yeah, mustache. Yeah, you look at each one of them, you watch all That's of them intently. They seem to pay you no mind. You seem to be standing <laughs> at the door. Absolutely. No one waves you over. It seems, it seems like it's almost on repeat. This night could be endless for all you care. And I attempt to determine who I think is the is the right one. <laughs> Why don't you roll an insight check? I think I might. I hope the walrus makes it. That's pretty damn, damn good. Pretty damn good. Please, DC, be low enough. I mean, you're, you can't be that unwise. It's gotta right? be 20. If you just roll I have a 21. I have a 21. Yeah, you're fine. 21. You start to look around and you realize that if you ask any of these people to take you through the tavern and to safety, that it would be the death of you. They'd pull a knife. They'd, 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 there'd be some sort of uh, violent outcome. Except for the one in the cloak. Seems like a, a trustworthy fellow. You still got it, Wendell! And I run up to uh, the guy in the cloak. And uh, uh, he reaches out his hand, and you take it, uh, confident that you're not going to get shanked. And as you do, bam! All of a sudden, as soon as uh, uh, your hand touches him, uh, you evaporate and find yourself on the other side of this threshold. Damn. Uh, I'm going to go he... If I end here... Will I see both of these for free? Uh, yeah. Okay. You would see those both for free. I'm gonna just, if I can basically be in this little space here. Yeah, uh, yeah. You're fried alive. <laughs> <laughs> you walk into the- I should have made real, real gutters. gutters. That's on me. No, you're good. You're good. Survival and history. Let's get this, let's get on that. Okay. Survival and history, and if you want a perception that leftmost uh, tile, uh, DC 15. <laughs> oh no! I did a Dr. Pisson! <laughs> I, I don't perceive. Jesus. I don't perceive. Uh, oh. Oh. I go directly for athletics. They can only be one. Uh, one and a half. half. In golf course. To, to athletics. One and a half, and you pop into athletics, and. Let's see uh, what I need if I need this. Uh, you stop yourself. Because uh, for a moment you realize that you were at the top of a very, very, very tall drop. You were at the edge of a cliff. Um, if you're picturing in Temple of Doom when they make it to the end of the rail cart, uh, mine cart uh, chase, and the water is like bursting on all sides, and they have to sort of hug the wall, yeah. you find yourself in that hugging wall cliff uh, uh, face scenario, and you realize that the exit is. 20, 30, maybe 40 feet over in that direction, but the only way that you're gonna be able to get there is by ninja warrior hanging from one to the next and gripping, uh, hold out for as long as you need to grip that wall before you slide to a terrible plunging death. Well, this would normally be difficult, but I have a trunk that I can use as an extra hand grip. <laughs> uh, Always with the three points for you. And it, right? it allows me to, to support an extra hundred of my own pounds, oh. which is uh, a, a good amount. Um, and and I see this, and I say to myself, I say out loud because I'm I'm just you know doing my thing, doing my bedrock thing. I say, uh, the path is lit, the way is clear. I only require the strength to follow it, and I do so. It's cool. That's a badass thing to say. Thank you. Pretty good. That's like a twenty-four. That trunk comes in handy. You're, uh, no, I lied. Twenty-two. You're making huge strides, uh, and you're able to. Uh, if I if twenty-two. Oh, twenty-two. Yeah, I got a twenty-two. Yeah, yeah, twenty-two makes. Sense. Okay, yeah. hang on to my inspiration. You make huge strides as you uh, 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 manage to uh, finger hang your way all from the way from the side that... Uh... <laughs> I would like to see what the last portal is. Turn it. Wow. Oh my god. No! <laughs> Sleight of hand, survival... Intelligence, wisdom, dex! History. That is my turn, I think. I'm just gonna position myself here. Uh, because I used one and a half, three, four, five, so I can go any way I need to. I think I'm good. That's my turn. Okay. And I still have my inspiration, thank God. I think Jean Claude may have saved my life. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm pretty sure that this is animal handling guy. So let's. Yeah, yeah. I'm doing one, two, three in that order. So animal handling guy. He's gonna endeavor to get through animal handling. Uh, he fails. He gets popped back to intimidation. I'm sorry. My bad. Damn it! You hear some cursing. Uh, <laughs> this guy's performance. Performance. He succeeds. He bops forward. And then where would you like to go? Animal handling, medicine, oh. persuasion, deception. Uh, medicine. 
You just go straight at Ford. And for that guy. then this uh, this guy will go after Dr. Poison. Okay. He's gonna oh. go after you. You do get to go My first. My turn? Yep. Uh, I am going to... I'm just gonna keep, I'm gonna just keep walking forward all the way to the end. Uh, everyone has a lot of health. That's fine. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, the tap in here. It's bad to be good. As I'm gonna go to the perception door. Perception door? Perception door. You um, pop in. And you realize uh, this feels extremely familiar. There's a, uh, uh, it's almost like you're back in one of your laboratories or workshops. Oh. But uh, it's been armed. You know that the, a wrong step here would cause uh, perhaps poison gas to fill and flood the I space. love poison As gas. much as you love poison, you know that you need to make it to the other end of this workshop before you escape, uh, so long as you can perceive the correct tiles to walk on. I want action! Mm. And I'm gonna proceed. <laughs> Your eyeballs pop out of their sockets. And, you know, go, go ahead and roll, roll up for the book. <laughs> Never did have You it. fuck. Never did have <laughs> 23. 23. Uh, you, uh,. Hop over here, and then looking, yes, this seems safe. Hop over here, and by uh, a few more hops and a few more steps, you are able to make it to the other uh, threshold. That's it. And this one is going to Four run up four, and man. endeavor to religion. I'm going to twist. Makes it through. Glitzy. Uh, uh, Glitzy is going to go up to, I think it's Deception, Deception's right? right, yeah, this one square. Uh, yeah, so what are the other ones? Just make deception, sure. Perception, Persu- Persuasion yeah, is next so to you. Perception, Deception, Persuasion, Medicine. Will be Deception again. And you're, you're already there. You're using your action to jump through and all of a sudden, poof, you find yourself in the same scenario uh, that you recall. And the same statue looks at you and goes, back again. Oh shit, I didn't mean to end up in here again. <laughs> Whoa! Take a reception check. Whoa! Uh, another 20. Another 20. Another 20. Another 20. It's, it's dropped, I think. Oh, it's a, 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 a dirty 20? Yeah, dirty 20. That succeeds. Uh, oh, you got me! And all of a sudden, you're not <laughs> flayed alive and burned into smithereens. You instead pass through the threshold. Uh, and I'm gonna stand right in front of Arcana. Ooh. Uh, I will make my way back to Persuasion. Okay. Because uh, I ain't going through whatever the other one is. Uh, and then try again. And that's the judge one. Yep. I you just... pop back and you find yourself standing in front of the same judge, the same court. Oh, hey, Your Honor. This is unrelated. Just don't forget to call. <laughs> uh, 27. Just mm. passing through. I won't. Yeah. Go on. I don't know why you're back here. <laughs> just passing through. Just passing through. I say, I say, I'm just passing through. You about through, uh, and you were able to cross the threshold. Glitzy, with that bombastic bad nature, you're going to need a little support in the, in the courtroom. Take this. <laughs> just know that it does start my retainer. <laughs> uh, and I toss, uh, I toss a bark That's inspiration in the, form of, uh, uh, in the form of a business card. And Jean Claude Chanticleer, lawyer in law, at your service. I'll put this in my fireproof wallet. Can I just stick it in my in my pocket? <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy a D8. Can you walk back up? Give me smoke speed to walk back I up. I can't imagine. I Where'd you start? To. I was like, oh, probably you were this oh, guy. Oh, you were, was, yeah, you were like over here. Cause we, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah we yeah. popped you on no, the side. No, I think that guy was here. I was here. Yeah, so yeah, I went yeah. five, yeah. ten. Yeah, you could probably move fifth. You got it on the square. I, I mean, I'd be trying to go towards you athletics, got it. Take, I guess. Take one more you, got you got it. Yeah. You got it. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. He was... He, was he here? He was here. This guy. That was, that's me. That's, that's Dr. Poison. That's Dr. Poison. He went to Arcana. No, don't don't go there. No, no, no. Stop. Go. Just wait in the other square. Can I say that? I mean, either way, he's popping out here. I try to get Jean-Claude to stay here. 
But it's up to you. If I would, well, if I could, if I can get that sense from the wall. <laughs> oh, dear God. <laughs> now, what is he trying to say? I say, I say, what is, what could it mean? Now, what exactly is he saying over there across that there barrier? You hear a very faint voice in the wall, Chris. It seems concerning. Uh, do you pause and you hear this, uh... It's a good question. Uh, these words uh, are these things. I don't, maybe, uh, maybe I roll a, uh, uh... Perception? Perception check? It's not a question of whether you hear. You do hear it. It's a question oh. of whether you heed his warning. The walrus I trust with my dear own life. <laughs> I'll stop right here on this here's way. Damn. You are as foolish as you look, Mr. Chicken Man. Well, that means not foolish at all, Dr. Hisson. <laughs> it's <laughs> pronounced poison. Do you? Oh, I say nothing in a language that I speak, and I speak them all. <laughs> you done it now. And that's about six seconds. The walrus. <laughs> I want Me action. Too. Until you suffer some. Do I get a, did I see Vortex Warp go through these walls like they're not like mag, anti-magic walls? Yeah, the spell successfully warped him, but that's because I wasn't trying to use teleportation in an advantageous way uh, so much as a disadvantageous way. Um... Okay, so I will walk up to the survival door here, uh, but before I go through, I will turn and you will see my crown of uh, never melting ice start to glow with this oh blue no. magic and some snow will start to fall. And I will use- I will, Another snow glow. I will, <laughs> <laughs> oh no. I will quicken, some PTSD. I will use my sorcery points oh to quicken yeah, a spell. Sorcerers actually are incredible in this. Yep. And as a bonus action, yeah. Rogue oh, take really my hand too. up! Yeah, because they dash as a bonus action. Yeah, Damn. yeah. Rogue and Sorcerer action yeah. to be able to go through the portals. Hey, pissing! <laughs> what killed the dinosaurs? <laughs> a meteor! It's the ice sandwich, you mean? <laughs> and in a cone, ice is gonna explode, and I want to point it this way. It's thirty feet. It should get this guy too. Go basically this way. <laughs> And I want to get these two guys, uh, and they need to make a. Uh, I'm casting Ugh. Rhymes Binding Ice. It's a con save DC 16. Oh, that's no probably way, not good it. enough. No. <laughs> is 16 is enough, I believe. I'm going to use my reaction. Oh! <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> I, I automatically fail. Yeah. Uh, um, uh, I got a natural 19, so the other guy's fine. I got what you, Elvis! So, either way, we are going to take uh, 3d8 cold damage, and for Dr. Pissin, he is basically tra trapped in ice. His movement is zero <laughs> until he uses an action to. Uh, oh, no! To that's a huge action. Two turns. <laughs> Holy shit! Or someone else can use their action if anyone cared. <laughs> <laughs> wow! How could this have happened? Your ice blocks. What I say in the kitchen room, we call that freezer burn. Eight, nine, ten, eleven. So you take twelve damage. He takes six. I think twelve damage. No, 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 not you. No, 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 no. Oh, oh. Doctor Poison. Doctor Poison takes twelve. Woo! That's cold. What did the uh, guards say in that movie when he's when they like the two guards like it's another day? <laughs> I will use my action to go through the survival door. I think there's like that was a bonus action. Was a bonus he quickened action. it. He quickened, oh, it. he quickened it. I love. Oh, quickened that's it. gross. Finally, a sorcerer yeah. pays off. Yay. Uh, survival yeah. door. Oh, okay, you know. Okay. My long rest didn't take effect. Yeah. You find yourself suddenly uh, in a frozen time. Uh, plane of existence, uh, a, a strange, not room, you feel like you're actually on the top of the world because looking all around you is cold blue sky, you're on the top of a mountain. You can see endless mountains uh, escapes in all directions. You can see that you're well, 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 well above the cloud uh, uh, line itself. Uh, there seems to be no vegetation. You realize that you're being hit with freezing cold and the um, 
uh, the sky starts to darken as all Ooh. of a sudden uh, you see the portal. It's it's but a hundred feet in this direction. You need only f- go from here to there. But the storm that blows in, the wind that hits you, you're going. You have to suddenly bundle and force yourself, push yourself to survive to get from one point to, uh, to the other. Did you say freezing cold? Yes. I'm resistant to that. <laughs> it seems to ignore your resistance and as you I'm realize. I'm just going to trudge forward <laughs> in ignoring uh, you, uh, my resistances magically. Make a survival check. Oh, golden. Do we think that's golden? I don't know. Wait, what wait, wait, what's your 17 plus... Oh. I think if you get plus three, you're good. Five. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. 22. I do think you're well, good. It's hard by the time you get to the end of that 100 it's feet. It's not good. You uh, push through the other side uh, and you find yourself, bam, uh, back into the warmth and the heat of the race. Uh, adrenaline still pumping, it, p- pumping as you were able Ooh. to uh, avoid freezing to death at One, the top two, of that strange mountain. Three, four, five, six. Nice. Well done. Damn. I'm over the line. Thunk. Oh, it's the barster. One, two and a half. I go for sleight of hand. Ah. Come on, we can do it. We're so close. Sleight of hand, um, you uh, pop into a place and you realize that you're staring at uh, the most complicated walk that you could possibly imagine. Uh, it is a uh, uh, on the front of a door, there is but one keyhole. All you would need to do is use the available thieves tools to tinker all of the tumblers in exactly the right order and uh, and 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 then push the, the the doors open, knowing that this is not a trial, that Babar B Babar can force his way through. He grabs the thieves' tools off of the table, sits down in front of this lock, takes a deep breath, and steadies his trunk as it goes to work. That's on the very lock. funny. <laughs> okay, That's very so funny. you feel like you have all the time in the world. Time is frozen around you. You actually can see uh, the freezing Doctor Poison. You can see your other companions all running and racing forward. I'm gonna use one twist of fate. I know. I'm, I'm gonna see what this ends up being. Oh, crushed it. Uh, I'm gonna use my inspiration on the 18 because I only have a plus two, so I rolled a dirty 20, and that's gonna give me a 27. So I'm going through. You tinker, and uh, uh, you are able to hear a, a click, and you push the door, and you are almost amazed that you were able to do it, but it was through almost sheer determination. I, I actually, I, after spending a long time on this, I, I, I feel some of the the, um, the spools land into place and some of the different security pins land mm-hmm. where they need to. And I realize I'm close, but I can't quite get there, even though I think that everything's in shape. And I remember Jean-Claude's business card, <laughs> and I take it out of my pocket, I form it into a shim, and I bump the rest of the lock by jamming it in there and pop it open. That's how it's done. Uh, as I get through. So two and a half, oh. I pop it on the other side, three and a half, four and a half, five and a half. I am just shy of crossing the finish <clears throat> line. That's my turn, though. Good turn. Um, okay, uh, what is this guy? He's going through not performance. What is the... Um, this this is intimidation. Oh, intimidation. Blows through it. Runs up the animal handling. <clears throat> this guy, medicine. Medicine. Absolutely wrecks it. Runs forward. Insight. Two. Insight, Arcana are the closest. Investigation's kind of uh, close. Let's give him investigation. So he'll move over there. Um, and then it's Dr. Poison's turn. You are frozen. How does that work? So for a minute, frozen. you yes. have ice around your legs. And so your speed is zero unless uh, you use your action to clear it. But I don't know if that would prevent you from, like, I guess I don't know if you're at one of the close enough to use your action to activate one of the doors. I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to look at Glitzy, who gave me bad luck. And I'll say, you did this to me, you pesky pixie. I'm a fairy, actually. <laughs> oh, my weakness. I hate being corrected. <laughs> My second biggest weakness, that is. I look around nervously. <laughs> it should be. I cast Vortex Warp on Glipsy. <laughs> oh no! Shit. 
Okay, how's wow. it work? Um, constitution saving throw. DC's only 16. 17. 17, Woo. that succeeds. <coughs> uh, that's my action. Uh, Jesus, this guy's evil. So you're still stuck. So, yeah, yeah, so yeah you're stuck. frozen and ice and can't go anywhere. My bonus action. Oh, no. I two weapon fighting. <laughs> <laughs> you have to use an attack action to use that. Oh, you idiot. <laughs> oh, well, I suppose every rose has its thorns. It's pretty good. <laughs> pretty good. And that's it. Mm. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, around with Dr. Perception. <laughs> Wasn't in the card for him. About to back to religion. Alright, uh, let's see. Uh, top of the round. Yeah, I'm gonna pop into Arcana. I know a th- I'm from the Feywild. I know a thing or two about magic. There's also investigation. No. Oh, okay. You You're yourself. actioning. Time's frozen around you. You narrowly dodge this vortex warp blast, and you duck down, and suddenly you find yourself with all the time in the world, or so it seems, for right in front of you on a pedestal, there's a floating, almost like orb, and you realize that uh, uh, it's going to require you to sort of stabilize its mani- uh, magical energies, or it could blow up at any second. <gasps> as much as you like explosions, it would be unpleasant and almost certainly deadly. Oh my god. I've always wanted to complete a Rubik's Cube before. And I'm going to start playing with it and see if I can. You sit uh, down. Put it into place. Make an arcana I'm gonna check. Use my thing. And you have inspiration, don't forget. I know. I'm going to use, I have a feature to roll an advantage um, on one thing. Bending so, luck or something. I, this is not touchscreen. <laughs> Damn it, I'm so old. You're feeling alright. I'm using screen. Tides of Chaos. You're covering chicken advantage. bits. Another one. Please. Well, you roll pretty well. I'm literally rolling ones and twos. Sometimes the dice decide. Yeah. Well, <laughs> sometimes I decide. So, did I give you another Very one? Very true. Whatever, yeah. just in case. There this is for this one. Um. There we go. Twenty. Twenty. You are sweating because it's getting unstable. So much so that it's actually hard to hold. It's moving by its own gravitic shifts. It's as you, these little green it ones almost they slips out of your uh, uh, out of your hand a few times. You have to grab it and wrestle it back down. But you start to put together that uh, uh, those symbols, those uh, those war um, wards, and all of a sudden, click. It calms itself and it brightens. And instead of being hit with an explosion, you are hit with illuminating light. That's uh, when it dims, you are on the other side, back into the race. Perfect. And then I'm going to move straight up uh, in front of Sledgehand. He's busy. Uh, I'm going to go, if I can... Get away from me, <laughs> foul. I'll say fuck yourself. You foul, foul. <laughs> you stupid, not a doctor. I uh, say, I say. Uh, my... Uh, Safe. Safe. Second <laughs> biggest weakness. <laughs> I thought your second biggest weakness was pixies and being corrupted. Oh, thank goodness you haven't discovered my first <laughs> biggest weakness. <laughs> Does that make any sense? I don't even want to know. Uh, so I, will, I will attempt the athletics uh, door. Okay, you pop in. Okay. You got the Jean Claude! We can do it! You suddenly find yourself, whoa, almost about to fall off. Oh, when all uh, you realize so that there is a uh, uh, a path requiring the only your fingertips to cross. I re-roll it. Okay. Oh! One more re-roll. One more re-roll. I only have one left. Well, you gotta do it. You just got What did you get? You just got to get through was, uh, the, uh, the first one I rolled was a natural one and a seven. Three, yeah. and, uh, and then you just got to get one. through this gate and like hopefully on the other side there'll be something better for you. Like sleight of hand. Sleight of hand's got to be a decent. little better. Oh, baby! Okay, okay, okay. 
21. Oh, you nailed it. Nice. Let's fucking go. Uh, you going. slip a few times, and there are a few times where you're hanging off of the <laughs> off of the edge, and you realize that <laughs> it almost feels like your wings are weighted. You would not. Yeah, yeah. It's you, between every yeah. handhold. Instead of moving, I go. There's a moment where you do actually like slip and you drop like five feet, and it takes a huge amount of effort for you to finally get back up and It's a double jumping in Banjo Kazooie. Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah. <laughs> but you make it to the other side successfully. Yeah. Oh. Uh, I knew you could do it! And then I'll just move. Oh, thank you. Yeah, you got walrus. Walrus. Do you can make it to slide uh, And uh, I will also offer uh, the walrus a business card. Don't forget no, about no, 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 no. I've already passed the oh, line. I'm just to order my list. How the walrus roll? Oh, I'll take it back. Who's the cautionary side? Glitchy. 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 Oh, please, have you take another business card. Oh, thank you so much. Add I was able to use your business card to finally complete a Rubik's Cube. Oh, well, I've never had that before. Most people just tear them up, but, uh, well, that's excellent. <clears throat> Walrus. Right you are, uh, safe at the least. You are the Walrus. You Presumably I can still... I'm not sure. <laughs> you <laughs> passed the finish line. You turn you're being carried off by pyramid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You realize that, that, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you realize that there's a, a, a barrier. You have to go. No way! Hold on, Doctor Pisson. If you're snake themed, why aren't you Doctor Venom? <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute! Oh, my first mate. Oh, my first <laughs> biggest weakness. Even a bigger weakness than my first. My ultimate weakness! The bar. I'm out. That chat's asking for John Claude's business cards to be added to the merch store. <laughs> <laughs> I can design the shit out of that. A pack of one thousand business cards in the John Claude law firm. Yeah, you should, yeah, you should, yeah, do, you should do John Claude law firm, like, notepad. Uh, oh, some yeah. post-it yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we, we gotta have a letterhead. Yeah, letterhead. It's gotta have letterhead. And, yeah. and you should do a post-it notepad that are the business cards, so you can this take right them. Oh, it's perfect. Shit. It's perfect. Yeah. That would be our foray. Branded fountain pens. I take five step. I take five feet moving forward and yeah. before I cross the finish line. There you go. I look back over my shoulder at Doctor Pisson, <laughs> <laughs> and, and I utter one word to him. I command him to halt. <laughs> okay. So you have to f uh, pass a uh, wisdom saving throw, a wisdom fifteen, and if you fail, you have to spend your turn taking no action, halting. Oh. <laughs> Halt! <laughs> and you are overcome. If you didn't get a 15, you are overcome by the magic of the command, and you must spend your turn. Uh, the target takes no, doesn't move and takes no actions. Wait, what's the saving throw? Uh, wisdom 15. Wisdom plus eight. <laughs> then you you meet it. If you got I'm seven. going no, to no. use. Plus one. I, two plus eight. one is an eight. Oh, oh eight. I thought you had oh, plus no, no, eight. No, 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 Holy yeah, yeah, yeah. shit! If it was caught. I would have succeeded. Okay. Barely. Okay. Then you oh, are no, you are halted for your next turn. And I oh. use the rest of my movement to pass through the barrier and reach safety. You successfully make it and you turn and you realize that all you can do is watch. Uh, and as I cross the barrier, I, I walk up to the walrus and I give him a high five. We've got it! Um, what is the next uh, challenge for the guy who's the farthest ahead? Here? Investigation. Investigation. Smashes it. Uh, and so we can get to history or survival, probably even if he's got enough movement, get a sleight of hand. Okay, he can definitely make it there. And the next one, at animal handling. Not even close. And Dr. Like, Poison. Like he makes it not even close? He is, yeah, he does not make it. He so gets back. Spot back. Does Holt mean that I take no action at yes. all? Oh. The, cre the, the target doesn't move and takes no actions. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to do? Toss me an apple? <laughs> My biggest weakness. <laughs> wow. I'm <laughs> That's a nightmare. Oh, what does it mean? An apple a day keeps the doctor. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's so stupid. <laughs> Um, with a natural 19, the this one moves up, and it's towards, Perception uh, or deception? Perception. <laughs> Boomy, you're a wicked genius. You're a mad genius. Glitfy. 
Oh um, god. You're up. I think I think I have slate of hands. Um I am friends with the walrus and he's kinda like Santa. So I'm familiar with slates. <laughs> so I'm gonna go in there. Do it. I do. Then you do it. Uh can someone move her into Sleight of Hand Town? She, yeah, she's here. She's, she's already there. She's, she's an elaborate she's door, in, the most complicated light uh, uh, lock you've ever seen, and a fresh set of thieves' tools lie before you. Okay. Here we go. You can do this. And you did the Rubik's Cube. You got this. Natural. Oh! Let's go. Fucking go, baby. You can, you can make it. You're there. And I, I will um, get, well, I'll get right in front of the finish line. And uh, I'll turn around and I'll look at Dr. Pisson, who's uh, not able to catch his apple. Um, he's <laughs> held and frozen <laughs> and pathetic. The apple strikes him in the face. And uh, I'll look at him and I'll say, Told ya, I was a fairy, and anyone who fucks with my friend with the walrus fucks with me. And I just flip him off and look across the. Nice. All right. So as long as Jean Claude doesn't fuck this up and this guy like squeaks in, we're golden. Yep, yep. All right, <laughs> John Claude. Do you have any twists left? As long as you don't fuck no. up. He's got no twists left. Uh, well, I say, friend, though, you look like you're in need of legal service. I don't know if I'm going to make it here, so take a card. And I toss him uh, a business card. Oh, thanks. You could have given this to yourself. What I really arrives, appreciate that. I can. I looked at that. <laughs> what, uh, what arrives uh, in his hand is actually a Polaroid of him in a compromising <laughs> photo. Uh, with a scantily clad... Uh, clearly, uh, lady that you would find in wherever Crummy is from. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Memories. Uh, yeah, pretty good. Uh, evidence of, uh, Karam's most foul. <laughs> it's an, uh, chicken era cocoa. Um, oh, it's foul! Yeah, there you go. Uh, yep. very funny. Uh, and, that's my bonus action. Uh, it, when he rolls next, he has to subtract a D8 from okay. whatever. And is that nice? Uh, Amazing. And nice. Oh, yeah, that's that fuck yeah. up. Huh? Oh, you're, you're subtracting D8. Ability. Yeah, no, he's this is proof oh, of crime. You just got a twist. We got a, we got four more, right? Oh my god. <gasps> Two thousand. Oh thank, wow. exactly thank, 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 thank you, EJ. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Traven Gore with thirteen hundred bits. That's thank you, that's thank you, thank you. Karen Mace. Oh. Three more. Uh, on top of the... I kiss it, but this is a Dr. Poisonous Poison. <laughs> and then you uh, said three more in the hopper? Three, three more in the hopper. hopper. Yep. Thanks to Bumpkin Wimdy 500. Thank you. Amazing. Uh, Thank you. Trading so guard four. is 1,300. They need it. So we have four in the... Wait. No, no, no. 1,300 that's 13 plus the five? Yeah. So that's just three. three oh. 2,000 got us to the distribution, and oh, then we so have... Now we're, at eight. we're 200 away we're from... 200 away from another from one. From the next one. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, yeah. Um, cool, cool, well, let's cool. see if these chicken wings still got it. Uh, and I'm going to the sleight of hand door. Elaborate lock, thieves' tools, all the time in the world. Well, fuck. <clears throat> That's pretty oh. fucking good. What's your plus? Gotta be high. Three, four. Yep. Oh! 22. Oh, 22. Um, you uh, uh, continue to uh, uh, finagle and Jimmy the lock until finally you find a rolled up uh, business card <laughs> just on the floor and you realize that you can use it perfectly as a shim and unlock the door with one final motion. Uh, and then you pass through the door unharmed. I That's too bad. I really like it. Because you, you, you spend right no there. movement going through. It's fine. You, you have exactly enough to make it through. Yeah. You were here. Oh. Yeah, yeah, you were here. Okay. You're yeah, good. Yeah. yeah. All right. Oh! Oh! Oh my oh, God! Thank you. Thank you. Shit! That's another uh, six, right? That's another. Thank you, Sloths. Sloths you've been a reading. Thank, thank, thank you so much. Morgan Maven with the twist. Oh, I thought you guys were reacting to the. So, the so Sloth says, a little known villain fact. The Walrus and Dr. Poison hate hatred started when one of them cheated at a game of mini golf back in Villain University. They each blame the other. To this day, no one knows who cheated or if anyone actually did. Uh, That's yeah. the truth! It's yeah. canon now! It's canon now! It's canon now! Oh shit! Um, <laughs> very funny! Alright, uh, I think it. the one that's farthest ahead. Oh, that's it. So that's it. That's four pass. Twists? That's fucking game. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Are you passing out our twists? Oh. We should do that. Um, Dr. Poison 
you uh, watch as the others around you begin to ignite and disintegrate and be pulled apart by the magic as all of a sudden, at the moment that John Claude passes the threshold, the space inside of you, all of the uh, challenge spheres uh, 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 burst away into flames and uh, you have uh, but your last thought and your last words before uh, life is taken from you. No, truly, this was an unskinny pop! <laughs> it's like that scene in Terminator 2 where the nuke goes off and all of a sudden Dr. Poison is blasted into nothing. <laughs> <laughs> the only <laughs> thing left in his place, a shiny red apple. Oh, that's uh, a uh, uh, See you in hell, oh, piss boy. Holding an apple. <laughs> My first weakness. Uh, you hear, uh, you don't hear this, but in a shadowy room, shadowy figures, shadowy faces all stare down. The <coughs> clients uh, are remarking about the terrific game, the race that they just witnessed, as deadly as it was for some. They've seen all of these different races uh, uh, happen with the different teams that had been assembled, all five of them. Uh, having just finished watching yours, they begin to murmur. Glitzy all the way, baby! Let's go, Glitzy! Fuck him up, girl! Jean-Claude lives! Yes! Jean-Claude! I'm sobbing! I'm so happy right now! The emotional walrus makes me tired. Someone finish him. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, the walrus was the most intimidating so far. The walrus has heart, which is not commonly seen in these events. It is refreshing, and he has my support. Aww. While I don't approve of his motives, I find Babar's drive and spirit rather inspirational. Babar is absolutely the best. Ah, Babar, the resilient Loxodon. It seems my choice was wise. His strength proves a, most, a formidable force in this deadly dance. Yes, Babar has proved to be very entertaining. Please finalize your wagers for the next game and enjoy a short break before we reconvene. You find yourselves on the other side of the finish line watching in horror as everyone is spaghettified inside of the arena, the race that you just uh, watched. Uh, watch uh, uh, doc, uh, Dr. Poison, and uh, for a moment you realize that you can hear announcers speaking. Ah, rest in piss, Dr. Poison. <laughs> and, uh... <laughs> Bozo. <laughs> Got him! <laughs> you can't say that! Oh, I guess we can say whatever we want. Cheers! And you hear the clinking of glass, and then uh, you're led <laughs> through the um, doors and uh, again uh, the, the um, Euclidean uh, nature of this space being what it is you walk through doors hundreds of feet away into this arena but going through these same doors walks you right back into the dormitory these magical portals being what they are uh, seem to always take you where you need to be led by the clients by whoever uh, is running this entire strange game they call the cuttlefish sweepstakes and you find yourself in a space just like uh, the dormitory that you've come to know with 20 fewer uh, contestants, Dr. Poison and three nameless NPCs among them. Oh my god, we did it! We actually did it! You know, I said it yesterday, well, I guess this morning before all that happened, we really should have just killed him before the games. Well, this works, because he died any anyway! Yeah, that's fair. There could have been someone more capable in his, in his place. Exactly anyway. right! Hands in, team! Well, I say good showing, everybody. Babar, I'm glad we all made it. Babar very tentatively yeah, puts his hand in. You can all tell right. there's hesitation. Our catchphrase! Go Tusks! No, no, no. Well, I'll say, thing, when though. did we establish that? <laughs> <laughs> when I was in that yellow yeah, contraption that was spinning off in the other room. You spending time with some pixies. I'm seeing a running theme here. <laughs> um, anyway. Uh, we are, I just want to bring it to everybody's attention here that, uh, that was a game, uh, where only four people won. And I think we're getting to the time where we have to accept that as much as I love all of you guys as friends, Glitzy looks out for Glitzy. So, may Phil Pip rest in peace, but when the fireballs rain from high, there's nothing I can do about it. And I'm gonna do what I gotta do to survive. Glitzy is right. She took the words right out of my mouth. The last two games, like she said, only had four survivors each. <coughs> it will not surprise me, nor should it surprise anyone, 
If the next game and beyond only allows for two, or perhaps only one, winner for flight. We have formed an unlikely bond, the four of us. But just know that I will not allow anyone to stand in the way of my goals. Yeah, I mean, as long as we're in a game where four of us can win, I will do what I can to protect you guys. The moment we get to a point where only three of us can win, or it's only a one person winning game, the stakes change a little bit, you know? And so I do think we should maybe rank each other on who we want to keep alive the most, so that we can all gang up on the weakling and make sure that they die first. And sorry, John Claude, I do think that's probably you, buddy. Oh, I'll say, that's ridiculous! The weak I was met with my I can't take that even a little bit, the way I'm tossing out business cards. I say, I say, eloquent is always, <laughs> Jean-Claude. <laughs> no! Jean-Luc! <laughs> well, 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 I didn't know they let two-bit lawyers into this sort of competition. Well, you should have because you're here! <laughs> well, no, I gave up my law practice in high school, if you recall, and I thought you know my brother, Jean-Claude is a despicable lawyer, and I never had the makings of a law. I was new and always the charismatic one, so I thought what is in a profession that is truly more vile, truly more necessary, and truly more despicable, so I became an accountant. Oh, 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 a fucking accountant? <laughs> ah, yes, I was in a top security prison. Were you the same? I never found out what happened to you after you took that case to represent this pathetic uh, craving of, a, of an elephant. Man. Well, yes, I say they found me out for fabricating evidence and, and murdering 20 people and we they had us in a, in a top Top secret security clearance of prison. That's child's play, Jean-Claude. I gotta say, you are no villain. Not our, our, our very truly evil father would be not very proud. As as deep fried and finger licking good as he was. A uh, Jean-Claude. Oh well, he yes, man. You glitzy. Yeah, me glitzy. Um. Do we like your brother, or do we not like your brother? The despicable fiend. No, we don't like him at all. Well, I'm oh, on okay. for numbers, all but right. not much else. So, also, do we kill your brother if we have the opportunity to, or no? I couldn't condone killing my brother in the next three minutes. <laughs> but once the clock strikes four minutes from now, we kill him dead. They, it is true that what they say, that kinslayers are cursed in the eyes of God and man. But I will let you decide if I am truly despicable. I was in that top secret security prison for committing all three taboos of alchemy as a transmutation wizard that I am. <laughs> Oh, the third worst, I transmuted metal into gold. The second worst taboo, I attempted humanoid transformation. And the third taboo, the worst of all the taboos of alchemy, I broke. Do not act against the government. <laughs> so when the tax man cometh, they rounded up me and all my clients. Cut to a dark room where alchemy has clearly just been performed. <laughs> uh, transmutation <laughs> magic. Uh, uh, a horrifying beast looks up at John Luke. John Luke hurt. <laughs> I say, I say, we can write that off. We can write that off. <laughs> John Claude, I have done terrible, unforgivable things. The people in this room are some of the most despicable in Avantress. Yeah. But an accountant? <laughs> I should splatter his brains across the floor now. I say absolutely right. I encourage you to do so. <laughs> well, just gonna I have say to, this. You have to wait two more minutes, though. I begin uh, to heft my giant maul. I say, Mr. Babar, if you splatter these brains all over the walls, <laughs> it'll take the custodian hours and days to clean it all up on account of its size. <laughs> my blood has not Boiled with the fury of a thousand bureaucrats until now. What I'll say is, you, after, after this, uh, this next challenge, you're gonna be so destroyed, so weak and worthless, your dead brother can claim you as a dependent. <laughs> 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 Jean-Luc 
Jersey Joe, man, boy. Sean I say, Luke. I say. I walk up to him. I get within an inch of John Luke's face, and I say, Sean Luke, you'd better hope the next game finishes you off quickly or painlessly, because if it comes down to me, you're going to beg for mercy. And I'll look right back at him, and I'll say, Bad Bar, be Bad Bar. I went up against the IRS. You think I'm afraid of you? <laughs> Tensions are high, Tax and it's not just between <laughs> the five of you all uh, uh, it's getting to know each other, realizing that you are maybe talking to friend, but also foe, certainly. In the next few games, uh, you may be forced to kill each other, or at least outdo each other in the performance of these cuttlefish sweepstakes. And uh, a fight breaks out across the dormitory room, and you hear smashing, crashing. Uh, you see magic going off. Uh, 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 there's an explosion of fire. Um, but uh, before you can blink, uh, the flight is over. The fight is over. And uh, two bodies cr uh, crumble to the ground. And above them stands a very ferocious halfling. Clearly uh, uh, the victor of this uh, uh, this fight and looks down uh, haughtily at the two dead bodies, spits, and then goes and finds the egg salad. <laughs> Hate that guy. I was watching him in the tug of war, and he thinks just because he's so mighty and small that he's better than everybody else, and I hate him. Should we just try to kill everybody else and get out of here? <laughs> yeah, but if we do that, then it's down to just the four of us. Let's just and split. then John Claude's dead brother. Look, we don't have to do this. We don't have to play by the rules. If we can just get out, we don't have to be gods. We can just go on to doing our various walrus-themed crimes. That is where you are wrong, the Yeah, walrus. no, I think you're wrong, dear. Because what? Because the thing is, I only had 30 more days left in the prison before I was a free woman. I came in here wanting to become a pop star of the stars. Yeah, I say you really did not make the right choice. <laughs> yeah, that, was, that was a large mistake in advised. retrospect. I've thought about it a lot since the first game where I realized that death truly was on the line and I realized that maybe leaving prison as a free woman and just starting up my own like yawn shop where I could sell yawn by the skein and uh, and teach people how to make booties would have been much better than all of this. But I'm here now, so I'm gonna keep lighting things on fire, killing a bunch of other people, and hopefully ascend to what is rightfully mine. Fame and infamy. Well, I suppose with a name like Glitzy, you just had to get it in lights. Couldn't yeah. be wasting away making yarns well, in some yarn shop. I'm also hoping that with a lot of fame, I can finally explain to people that the bang isn't quite what it sounds like, and it's more about bombs than anything else. <laughs> What else would it be? <laughs> You're all guided that way from <laughs> You all enjoy I'll say, line. well, I guess all of my companions and clients all got horribly murdered in other games. So I'll guess I'll tag along with you for the amusement. And you, that, know, you know what they say, a family that flocks together dies together. <clears throat> And you're all directed <laughs> to uh, join in uh, together in groups of six. Now that there are uh, only 18 remaining, uh, three teams are put together and guided through separate doors. Uh, just uh, uh, without prompting, uh, very silently, the halfling walks up uh, uh, and uh, uh, finishes an egg salad sandwich with a couple uh, bites and through. No. You have some egg on your face. Was that the last one? <laughs> You're going to have egg on your face when we are through with this next game. Okay. Are you threatening to kiss me or something? Because that would, I would not be okay. I would, that wouldn't be acceptable to me. We made that. And I don't find myself attracted to you in any way. If and I don't know why you would me, bring you that up in that. front of my friends. If you want to, I'm not going to stop you. You're a very beautiful fairy. Why are you, I, okay, okay, we can't. Uh. What is your name? My name is Gorim. I'm, I'm sorry, what? Gorim. Gorim, okay. Yeah, they call me the Bang. Um, and has nothing to do with bombs. I mean, it has everything to do with bombs. I am not sure I believe you. Gorim Stone Fist. Oh, God. <laughs> I shakily shake he, his hand. He kisses it. it, oh. it, it his hand feels like uh, uh, warm marble, uh, the strength oh. of it underneath, uh, 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 underneath mm. your palm. Um, oh. And he pulls away. Well, are we ready to do this? Gorim. Yeah. I say, I say, boy, if you were an investment, you'd be short term. <laughs> <laughs> what well, I say, I say, that was pretty fucking funny. <laughs> Are you making fun of my hype? 
I, I, I say, I say, that's what, uh, that's what I said. Did I fucking stutter? Well, I said, I said, your intelligence is all neck next if you hadn't got that one. It works on a multiple. Days. I gotta say, your cash is quite liquid, my friend. I will take it out on you on the field of play. And he pushes past you and walks in through the uh, door, and you're all led. To an arena, uh, uh, another arena, uh, and I'm gonna ask you to clean uh, the uh, space so that we can create the next area. Hey, Freebird! All these years, you never introduced me to your brother. Well, <laughs> no, absolutely not. I say, I say, I hate the, the, the scoundrel. Though he is quite funny sometimes. <laughs> We called him Fever back in the guild because his clients always got acquitted. That's very funny. <laughs> well, I mean, uh, is all he does tax-related jokes? <laughs> no, he also does tax-related crimes. <laughs> exactly <laughs> right. <laughs> Fair point. My, in, in my supervillain guild, I was called the White Collar. <laughs> actually amazing. That is actually incredible. <laughs> I was born to play the Count I was born to do this! Uh, uh, I've never heard so much tax related jokes or ever before! <laughs> yeah. Well, I say, I say, just don't let him do yours, because he always signs his name at the end. It's his fatal flaw. That's why he never gets away with it! <laughs> Uh, we're gonna draw the map here. Let's look at this. I say, I say. Oh, here we go. <laughs> yeah, let's save it for the <laughs> for the session. Let me grab some coffee while we're while we're waiting. Nice. Another battle royale. Oh fuck. Out. Sit, sit for me so that I can see if uh, I sit can down. Do it properly. I don't think I'm gonna make it. <laughs> My feet are so cold. I think this is it. I need a heated blanket for the table. Heated floors. Next studio. <laughs> so we've all been split up. Yes, you walk through and all of a sudden blinking you realize that you're all standing on other side uh, on uh, platforms um, leading to what is uh, an impossibly um, far drop. You can't even see the bottom of this huge airy space. Uh, and as you are staring out you realize there is uh, um, uh, nothing above or below. It just seems to be this massively deep chasmic uh, shaft almost. Uh, there, uh, you could fall forever and perhaps not see the bottom of this thing. Um, and all of a sudden, in front of you, uh, each of the tiles here, each of these many different tiles, um, light seems to shift and shimmer, and these panels sort of f pop into existence and start to float and hover there in the air, and then the next one floats and hovers next to it, and then two more spread out, and before long the entire uh, field of play has been covered in these floating pa uh, panels, and it becomes obvious to all six of you that you could stand on one of these for a short time before it failed and broke, perhaps like glass or uh, 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 like uh, magic, um, and, and, and a voice uh, rings out. Six enter, only three will leave. Jeez. Mace is using the wrong arrow code. 
What, what did he say? Uh, o- o- only six will leave? Yes, that's, uh, uh, no, he said three. Three will leave. Uh, presumably when the, uh, 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 they walk across these magical tiles, they're, 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 they're only gonna only be so many. They're gonna start disappearing very rapidly. They'll have to keep moving around and then perhaps strategically corner each other or otherwise fall to their death. Oh, oh that's terrifying. Do you think they think that they can affect the tiles in other ways? Probably. If it were me, I'd find ways to destabilize the arena as quickly as possible so that others fall through before I do. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. You know, you're surprisingly good at this, Verrett. Yeah, I was in the Cuttlefish Sweepstakes once. And let's roll for initiative. <laughs> oh, shoot! <laughs> Fuck. This is not good. Oh, man. Let's fucking go. <coughs> not very good. I say, I say, I'm using one of my twists. Fuck! I got the same roll. It's a three. Throw it in, so that we can. Uh, oh, use. yeah, I use the twist as well. Sorry. Are you actually using the wrong arrow, Cobra? Yeah. <laughs> so you should have had thirty feet the whole time. Yeah. It's fine. I don't. Think, I don't think it fucked you that hard. You're still alive. You're still alive. And yeah. you got an entire free session. And then I've just got to send it to my final form. I see. I say, could you quickly summarize the, the game? I was distracted by looking at the character sheet. Well, I say also, if you wouldn't mind summarizing the game for me as well, I was distracted looking at the character sheet. That's my pleasure. Uh, so, um, you each need to probably have something along these lines. As you make your, ma- your way What's across... Uh, here's how I would do it. As you make your way across the field of play, um, you can try to uh, uh, discourage, hurt, uh, or uh, buff or help any of the additional other players that are inside. Once you cross this threshold, you will be in here and you are trapped. You might fall because anytime you walk on uh, on a tile, you should mark it. And at the end of your turn, any mar- uh, tiles that you've marked off, I'm sorry, at the end of your next turn, at the end of your next turn, any t- uh, tiles that you've walked on will be X'd off. That's that's essentially it. Is it filling these spaces as quickly as possible and trying not to. So here's what we'll do. When you step on something, we'll create a dot. At the end of your next turn, your dots turn to X's. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, a dot is still something you can walk on, and right. a cross off is something that you can no longer walk on. It's 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 just air. Now you can jump from tile to tile. Uh, any valid uh, terrain still is uh, something that you could uh, land on. Um, do I feel like I would have? for like things that would have taken a minute or so to cast. Would I have been preparing or just totally fresh for this com- for this comp? Um I would say that there's the oh, announcement yeah. time, there's sort of time for everyone to assess, there's been a time for the uh, uh the just voice to describe the rules. Yeah. With just one minute you'd be able to pull something off. Okay. Um, and I would grant any of you that same minute, uh, should you want to do something in preparation before uh, the initiative begins. Mm. Take a moment. Uh, this one's gonna get ugly. Yep. That's all I can say. Uh, and did everyone roll for initiative? Yep. Uh, 15 to 25? 22. Nice. Uh, 19. I got a 19 as well. Ooh. Roll off. Roll off. It's 13. Uh, 10. Okay. Uh, t- 10 to 15? I got an 11. John Luke? Huh? Oh, John Luke. John Luke. Uh, initiative. Oh, John Luke, I got a. Uh, that'll be a, uh, an 8. <laughs> an 8. I say, I say. Dollars, ribs, and trip. Uh, walrus, <laughs> uh, you are up, as they say. 
Um, you feel the, the wall behind you almost force you out into the field and you realize standing on the surface of this platform, um, there are very thin grooves, gaps between the platforms, but it doesn't look like anything could squeeze between them. It's solid ground, but they already, the light is almost dimming and shrinking, having been touched just once. Uh, you know that you have to keep moving very quickly. Meaning, do I think that I could use my movement and like just go one square and then just stay there? The tiles that you touch will disappear at the end of your next turn. Okay, so I could yeah. just go yes. one square by one square every single round yes. if I wanted to. Sure. Yep. I will jump down. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six. I'll just run straight out here. Oh! I don't know what kind of strategy I have! <laughs> What are we gonna do, Tusks? Who's with me? I'm, I'm with you, the walrus, but s some of us are gonna die. Well, I'm with you too, but definitely we're not all making it out of this one. I'm not gonna go against you, but I'm gonna be all for myself. Uh, let me see the spe the range of my spells here. Jean Claude. We didn't get any kind of rest in between the... No. Just a short rest, I guess, technically. Yeah, technically it would have been a short rest. Not long, though. Mm, one, is this? Is he within 120 feet of me? Probably. Or sorry, 60 feet? Uh, that's no, a little, that's a little so. farther. 12 squares. Uh, one so, and, one and a half, three, uh, uh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, uh, twelve. So it's out of range. If you have extra movement, use it. So instead, I'll go here first. <laughs> Sorry, I've never met you, you before. If you, need to, if you need to remove pips, then do. I got it. You got it. Thank you. Thank you for being my uh, uh, my game, the game master. And by that, I guess I can't be the game master. The rule master. Yeah. The game state keeper. The the field master. I will take my. Uh, do I have a scepter? I forget what I have. Master? I'll point it at um, Jean Luc <laughs> and cast Ray of master. Frost with my action, and then I will finish my movement. I say, I say, what did you do, boy? <laughs> uh, Poor Andy. It's okay. It's gonna be, this one could be a long one. Oh, it's just a spell attack. I say, not when I'm about to do what I'm about to do. Thank you. You guys are not. Spots. 25 to hit? Damn. That hits. I say, I say, that hits. <laughs> if it makes you feel better, I'll use those so we can mark them off. And that way don't have to worry oh, about. 16 points what? of cold damage, no and your speed easy. is reduced by 10. Damn. Until the start of your next turn. I say, I say, do you want to do that? Because on account of our cast, a, the, the, my client that was the, one of my ultimate alchemical taboos, and cast Phantom Steed, as I'll clap my hands and place them on the ground, <laughs> as a large transmutation circle, and from beneath me you'll hear, right off. Right. <laughs> That's right, brother. That's right, brother. I say, I say, I can create commands with the wave of a hand, and a horse-human, like a dog hybrid, appears beneath me as Yikes. I get ready to ride. Yikes! Pure evil, kill him! <laughs> <laughs> I say, I say. How much damage is twelve? Uh, uh, was it twelve? I think it was twelve. Right? Plus five? I think it was more than that. No, it wasn't. Chat will tell us how much damage, chat. No, it was 12. It was 12. I'm pretty sure it was 12. I remember it was 12 as well. Uh, John Claude, you're up. Well, I say, I say, I say, that's brand new. Uh, okay. That's you, right? That's brother. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. All John right. Luke. I will. Uh, I will go here and then 10. 15, 20, 25, 30, go here. And I will shout out to that guy. Um, Gorum hears you. Gorum? Um, well, I say, I say, I say, Jean-Claude says, take one step forward and stop. And I cast suggestion. <laughs> That's a fucking amazing. That's brilliant. <laughs> What's there, the, are, there are some uh, spells in this that are extremely powerful. Yeah. <laughs> what is the... Uh, oh. Uh, um, it is a... Uh, wisdom or, level, or maybe it's is just... It, is charisma? I can't remember. It is a... Wisdom saving throw. Yeah, wisdom 16. Oh, so many. <laughs> wisdom, wisdom 16. 
Uh, that's a 14. I'm going to use a twist of dread. Ah, uh, don't, uh, don't do it. Nope. He fails. <clears throat> so he takes one step forward. Yep. And then he's just stopped. Well, he's on stopped. his turn. On his turn. Oh, yeah. sorry. Okay. Um. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah. Yeah, on his turn. That's it. And that lasts You're for eight moving? hours. As long as you don't lose concentration. You're not moving? I moved to get enraged to do that, Oh, oh I'm feet. sorry. So I should be yeah, yeah, the, suggest, the suggestion I can't save against again. No. Correct. That's just eight no. hours. He, Unless somebody no, like, knocks you knock the concentration. That's but the only th- way to stop it. Theoretically, well, I don't know that you like lose your action or anything, but you are you would be compelled to... Take the idea, the Presumably idea. take on the persona of a wrestler. Okay. <laughs> and you would be compelled Walk to stand one, there. Take one step and then take stop. Take one okay. step forward and stop. And he can't repeat that. He can't go one step and then stop and then well, one step and then stop. Correct. Yeah, I suppose correct. that's up to you, but it was not my intention. But he's test. He's toast. He's he has toast. A way to, unless he has a way to break concentration. My intention was for him to take one step, like, what, like just take one step and then stop. Okay. Okay, <clears throat> but you are the almighty. No, that's that's fine. King of the world. That's mean, but that's fine. That's really mean. Uh, okay. Uh, anything else you want to do on your turn? <laughs> what? Any, oh no, no. I think I think that's. I don't think I can do anything. Glitzy the bang. Um, I am going to move forward three, and then towards Richie three. Uh, he takes one step forward, and then stops, and he turns, uh, he gives first, uh, Glitzy a little bit of a wink, and then he pulls out a spear, and seeing you, he's like, I will kill you for this. If I cannot survive, neither can you! And he tosses a spear at you. Oh, shit. He gets a natural 20. Um, oh my well, God. actually. Is, oh, there's no way he's in range for you to. That's what I'm looking at. It is as long as I can see. Oh, that's crazy. Someone that I can see. I'm going to use Fuck two yeah. sorcery points and I'm going to remove a d4 from his roll. Uh, natural 20 automatically hits. Doesn't Would it not that. crit? So, I mean, I don't know. So, natural if it's reducing 20, if it, the roll. It's reducing the roll. Okay. I'm not right. sure that Great you question. can reduce it by a number. Great if you question. Can, if you can disadvantage it. Presumably, you can take a twenty and get it down to a one, uh, a nineteen, it's, it's eighteen, a, it's seventeen. It's a bonus or, or penalty to the creature's roll. Yeah, I don't know. I'm going to say that. It's, it's up to you. No, I believe rule is written. Yes, rule yeah. is written. It would not, but it, it's up to you. Oh, really? Let, let, let me just do oh, a quick it, Google. Listen, yeah, here's the thing. Yeah. I don't know. I'm curious. Curious. Rules is written. <laughs> so, yeah. um, curious. What's the name of the feature? Bend luck. Interesting. This is one of those. When like, another funny creature you can see makes an attack roll and an ability check or a saving throw, you can use your yeah. reaction and spend two sorcery points to roll a 1d4 and apply the number rolled as a bonus or penalty your choice to the creature's roll. You can do so after the roll, but before any effects occur. Are we long rested after the last no, one? No, we're short rested. I said, uh, death is the longest rest. <laughs> I feel fine. <laughs> Let me short rest. I should use my bonus action on Call him a bitch. My guess is that Glitzy's gonna get her two sorcery points back. And that's fine if I do. I can use them for other things. Yeah, that's my guess. But I will be surprised if it works. I see. Okay, it does not change the dice, the naturalness of that 20. If it, as an example, if my plus to hit was plus five, I have a 25 to hit, so I would reduce that 25 down to 24, 23, 22, or 21, but it doesn't change the 20 to a 19 or lower. So I you will would not keep, negate the I will keep yeah. my sorcery mm. point. Okay. That's a good call. Um, so Funny you keep it. Corner case. Yeah. I do 13 points of no, piercing damage to you as the spear slices into you. Oof. Uh, and I don't play spellcasters well at all. So how do I roll for concentration? That's roll a d20. Oh. Mm-hmm. This is a con you, save. You play a sorcerer. DC I 10. I stand by my statement. <laughs> DC 10. You rolled a natural. Perfect. Point. You're good. A natural what? 10. 10. 
So 13, yep. 13 in total. Well, uh, there's nothing I can do about that. So uh, Gorum stays Sorry there. Sorry about it, Gorum. How, how much damage does that take? You, 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 hit me, you crit me. Oh, it was 13. Uh, 14, 14. 14. Oh. Was it 13? I thought it was 13. It was 9 plus 4, 13. It was 13. I'll take it. Alright, I'll add one. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Uh, that's gonna be the... So it's he's so fucked. Sad. That's unfortunate. Um, Babar. Oh, man. I'm just making sure there's nothing else I can do here. This gives me anxiety. Uh... I end my turn. Okay. You could dash. I'm good. Okay. Thank you, Rich. Very cool. <laughs> and very legal. I end John Luke. Um, I will, uh... Slap my hands, and I'm going to place it on top of my horrible uh, chimera creature. Right and right uh, I'll say, Sail, sail, sail! As I cast haste on him. Uh huh. Oh. Wow. And I'm going to dash with him. Uh huh. My speed is 400 feet. <laughs> oh my god! Okay. And you're large. And I'm large. Uh, here's your large token. I got, I got a mini. Oh, you got it? Okay. Holy shit. It's pretty bad, it is. So I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say... Wait, who's, who's who? That's Babar. Babar. That's oh, at the other end. John Claw's at the other end. That's Gorum. Babar. Gorum is the skull. Gorum's the skull. Uh, five, ten... The only thing I ask is try Maybe to figure out so we can mark as we go, since this is so many, try yeah. not to edit your path as much as possible. How do I basically... Can I just like do math it out of what 400 squares would be? You can. 400 feet in squares yeah, would be? Yeah, well, first start dividing it by... It's like 80, it's a large it's like creature. 80. It's like 80 squares. If you turned left... Right, divided by and five... And started circling the entire thing, you could shrink the field of play very quickly. That would be one way to so do it. So if you, you want to go... Five, it's 80 squares. If you want to start snaking this way... We it's can just get rid of 80 squares. Four. No, no, no. 400 divided by 5 is 80. Is 80. Okay, got it. Got it's it, got 80 squares. It. It's yeah. 80 squares. Because mm -hmm. you have 400 feet divided you by 500 feet. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Well, he'd be chunking two at a time. I know, I know. I'm just, I'm just trying to. I'm just gonna basically blaze past everybody here. All right, so you went this way, you tucked in here. Yeah. Yep. Oh, sorry, sorry. Not okay. You went this way. Yep. Jesus you you don't want to you you're not you you're can't not going, going over my head. Correct. Yeah. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. I think he's at twenty there because I'm two to get out. Twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, yeah. twenty-three. You're saying that's twenty-five? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It took him two to get two out. To get out. out. All right, we'll call it twenty-five. You just want to keep going? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna keep going. Twenty-six, basically. 20, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four. 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43. Tell me when to stop. Uh, and then this is it. Cut here. 44, 45, 46, 47. Cut back here. 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57. And then just snake it. 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 66, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79. 80. It's gonna be close. I might be off by like five feet. I think that's yeah, that's yeah, pretty yeah, fucking close. Like that. That's fine. Right. So just give me a minute here. Holy, Holy shit! shit. <laughs> We're, in folks. We're in deep shit. Very well played, Mike. Very well. I played. say, I say. Oh no! It's okay. gonna be oh, a crash. Yeah, you don't care about these guys because they already or were you? No, like, no. He, he, he wanted to go against the wall. I that's think. fine. Yeah. yeah. No, actually, this is fine. This is fine. Just keep keep it. No, no, no yeah. Just just get rid of that one, and then just 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 yeah yeah. Easy fix. And then just get rid of that one dangler. Done. 
Holy shit. Well done. Well played. I am shocked. I am I'm shocked. Where did he end? He, uh, here. Oh, okay. Uh, I can, yeah, yeah, give or take five feet. That's my turn. Holy shit, that John Luke is one hell of an accountant. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all the counting he just did. That's, pretty, that's, pretty, uh, that's very You funny. ain't wrong. Um, I, Kill him! <laughs> the walrus. For Was the it my turn? That is oh, holy. oh uh, now that it's your turn, oh. X off oh, the... Um, oh, it's no, at the, the end, end of, my of your turn. turn. At the end of your turn. Holy shit. That's yeah, so the only funny. problem here is going to be just, nah, it's going to be fine. It, it, it should be alright. Jesus Christ almighty. Spells. What's the range of this? 30 foot cone. Four and a half, six. Oh yeah. Uh, the first thing I'm gonna do this is, is I'm gonna shoot another uh, ray of frost at Jean Luc. Sure. Jean Luc just painted a big target on his back. I say, I say, I didn't come here to make friends. That's pretty good. Uh, Twenty-one to hit. Ah oh, fuck. How many hit points can you possibly have? 14, 15, huge. 15, 15, 18, 19 points of damage, oh, full damage. Fuck. Make a concentration check for that haste. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I say on account of my trans, my philosopher's stone, I am proficient. Ah, the trans, my philosopher's stone. Oh, I say, oh, I say, I'm gonna, I I'm gonna bend your uh, lock uh, minus a d4. I, I don't think you should save that, right? Oh, yeah, okay. he, I think you got like a billion. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. I, 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 I We're, just, we're so fun. I say, I say, I say. <laughs> Uh, did you, did you took the damage? Yes. Okay. I say I am not looking good. I say. <laughs> Jesus. One, I instantly two, came over three, three, four. Oh, by the way, dude, you gotta get well. Rich, I also want to say, if you want to instead attack the mount, the second the mount take any damage, it's dead. We wouldn't know that. Oh, I don't, I don't know if you would know that. I wouldn't know we that. Wouldn't I, know I didn't that. know that. You're happy with this path? Yep. And then. And then is the mount is... considered a creature? Yes. Okay. You can target it however you like. Cool. It uses warlock stats, fall. but it's faster. Um, things are heating up very quickly here in beautiful. Oh. John Claude, you're up. It's just you and me. You cannot escape without me moving. Well, Turn off your suggestion, and I will help save you. I say you're gonna move pretty far at the end of your next turn. <laughs> <laughs> I say, I say, I say, I say, I say. That's uh, the brother I know. I <laughs> Don't think you can fly. I curse you to the nine oh. hells, Jean Claude. <laughs> well, maybe waiting for me yet. Um, do I think I can fly in this room? Yeah. You haven't heard anything otherwise. I mean, if he can summon a fucking phantom <laughs> steed and cast ace on it, I hope you can fucking fly. Uh, I I look at Jean Luc and I uh, put my hand up to my mouth and I'm in the hill here, uh, uh, whispering in his ear and say, uh, w "Where'd you find this one? I mean, it's a lot. But <clears throat> I say, I say, I say, uh, it, it's a lot prettier than your previous paramour." Uh, and I cast dissonant whispers. Bro, uh, um, <clears throat> it's my action. Um, uh, you have to make a save, a wisdom save of 16. Me? Yeah. I say, I say, oh no! I say, I'm gonna use a twist! Uh, this? Yeah, below, yep. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Yeah. I uh, say, I say, with that oh. twist, uh, what, what do I have to use? Uh, Constitution? Wisdom? 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 I, I say, I say, it's that'll be I a 19. Think, Damn. What are you trying to do? Dissonant whispers. How so does that it's, work? Like, what uh, does it do to him? It's damage. Oh, nice. Um, but targets will make a wisdom saving throw on a failed save. It takes 
4d6 psychic damage, it must immediately use its reaction. Uh, on a successful save, it takes half as much and doesn't have to move away. Um, I'll say, how much damage is that? So. <laughs> Just look at what's happening on the battlefield. Damn. Damn. Okay. <laughs> okay, Jean Claude. Uh, would have been 16, so 8. I say, I say, fuck. Uh, and I will move. You can walk over dots. I would try and. Do, if I now reveal that I have 30 feet of movement, do I? <laughs> I would. I think I would try and get. Over Gorm, if I think I could like fly over him, that'd be small. With the jump rules, if I, if you, I could move, you, I'll, I'll just tell feet, you, you do not feel that teleportation or fly magic is being punished in this. Place. I take to the air. Man, <laughs> <laughs> no, it's more. Like this, you want to go right? straight? You want to keep going this way? I just want to go. One, yeah, one past him. That's thirty. That's your turn. Or you? That's my turn. Any mark? Uh, yeah. And then, oh, you're flying over him, so yeah. Glitzy. Uh, I'm gonna turn to Jean-Luc, and I'm gonna look at him, and I'm gonna cast Nelthair's Mischief. I say, oh horse. fuck! Okay. Um, <laughs> Oh, God. oh no! It it just happened. So it's a twenty foot cube. It's a cube, yeah. Yeah, and I'm gonna place it over him, and then I have to roll a d4, and that's gonna determine what happens. I say there might be yummy apples in there. <laughs> I love. <laughs> I saw that snake fella. Uh, we need we need a directional thing. Oh, scatter die. Yeah. Uh, I say I oh. say oh fuck. Yeah, just make me north. Oh. That's fine. Yeah, 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 do it whatever you want. Fine. All that matters is that it's random, right? The D8, right? The, yeah. yeah. Cool. Okay, so roll a D8. Five. South. South. Towards Rich and I. Okay, so. Um, That's good. You, you watch as Glitzy takes out uh, what looks like a stick of dynamite, but it's really just. Um, uh, it really is just. Uh, uh, like pixie stick dynamite, and it's filled with glitter as she tosses it at him. This glitter um, dynamite goes off around Jean-Luc, and each creature in the cube must succeed on a wisdom saving throw. So you do get a wisdom saving throw. Oh, that probably succeeds. I say, I say... Your horse has to do it too, by the way. I say, I say, the horse has a, <laughs> is a riding horse. Let me pull up its statistics. And you're on top of it, so yeah, this might true. actually matter. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, what, you pass handily, but it runs it. it I say, I say, I wisdom. I'm gonna use one of my twists on my horse. I suppose, I suppose I could. I suppose. I, oh, oh boy. <laughs> One more, one more twist, one more twist in my horse. One more twist, one more twist. One more twist. Oh, fuck. Okay, my, my horse gets a 13. I, however, succeed with a, a 20, I believe. The horse begins giggling until the start of its next turn. It is incapacitated, and it uses all of its movement to move in a random direction. And that random direction is south. And that happens right now. Wait, on its turn, or, or...? It is incapacitated at the start of its next turn, period. A giggling creature is incapacitated and uses all of its movement to move in a random direction. So he can't take action. So if, it's he, if he's using his movement, it's on his turn. Yes. That would happen. Okay. So on, yes, at the at the start of its next turn, the horse will immediately move south. He's toast. All of its movement south. Well, we, we, yeah, we'd have to see if it's going to fly off and of then it. it's gonna, and then it's going to collapse. But can he jump off the horse? Great question. It yeah. immediately yeah. after me. Okay, so you, yeah, you, yeah, yeah. you ah. stay, uh, the horse yeah. is taken care of. Okay. The, the horse, horse will no test. longer be yeah. able to do it. The horse that's is huge. That's right. Fuck. Oh, we almost got him. We Glitzy. almost got him. Help. I'm so sorry, my forbidden love, but is every man a woman for themselves? And then I am going to move. Um, forward three, and then towards, towards Mace three. Towards Derek three. Yeah. One two three. 
One, two, three. Okay. Things and then are the getting ones, very the ones sweaty, that were very activated last time that I moved over aren't those X's now too? These are. The just dots. these. Just yours. Oh, so the dots don't change regardless if someone no, walks on them. You can't make them. it like worse. Oh, okay. Yeah, only okay. the, the path at the. Uh, they think it might be a loose cord because it only happens when Andy moves. Do you want to turn us off and back on again? Right here? Yeah. No, is that something we should. What? We can do? What's going on? It's a camera. Just Apparently just we're, we're uh, shaking. Wait, wait, before you turn it back on. Is it the chicken on the wire? Oh, it actually might be. Uh, <laughs> it probably is. No joke. Off that wire. No fucking joke. Uh, that's what we get for firing chickens There's around. No way. Yeah. Hold on. Yeah, and then make sure, make sure that the connection. Make sure everything's yeah. And and into the camera too. The the the, yeah, the other the, the data, data cable. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Oh, it was a little loose. Okay, that's probably what it is. Okay. <coughs> Thanks, chat. Oh, uh, the map cam is also frozen. I can hardly believe what I'm watching. Uh, we normally enjoy non-lethal flim flail, and we're I'm watching like, people literally try I'm to kill each other. Happen. Yes, it's much more entertaining. <laughs> you don't like the chicken. I'm just, I don't know what's going on. No, the roof no, no, is, no. is clattering I, I, above me. I think, I think the movement ha happens now because it says that they get to roll again to um, they get to roll again at the start of each of their turns. Huh. Oh. What, what is, is it the called? name of the ability? It's called Nail Nathair's Mischief. Oh no, no, I roll again at the start of each of my turns if I want to change it. Okay, that's what it is. Uh, yeah. That's what it is. Uh, okay. The it's not blue. Yeah. The camera's not blue. No, I do. Can you look it up? I do think it happens right away. So this, I'll read exactly what it says. Each creature in the cube must succeed on a wisdom saving throw or begin giggling until the start of my next turn. Mm -hmm. A giggling creature Sorry. is incapacitated and uses all of its movement to move in a random direction. Yeah, so if, if it's it would using use its, its movement, movement it, okay. it has to yes. be on his turn. Right, yeah. yeah. Okay. I say, I say, we need some ribs and shrimp back again. Oh, I say, I say, that sounds like a good time. The ribs and shrimp are back, and holy shit, what the fuck is Gorm doing? You sentenced me to death, and now perhaps we die together. Gorm uses his action to attempt to grapple you. <gasps> what? <laughs> oh. Yeah, you maybe should have not stood next to me. Oh, what, no. How does that work? I make a strength athletics check. Against and you your... make acrobatics or athletics. Oh, whatever's or, higher. Okay, acrobatics. These are special. Yeah, let's make sure. I'll twist it just in case. I'll twist it just in case. Let's shoot one over here. What does it say? Eight. <laughs> ah, I rolled eight last Also, time. give me one of your uh, coins. Uh. You I guess I don't have the ability to like bonus action or anything right now, do I? No. No. You know, at least give it some special reaction. Do you have cutting words or anything like that? I like, don't uh, know. Silvery barbs. Yeah. No. No. You uh, silvery barbs. You're, you're a freaking what you call it. You he, certainly have a you reaction. Can use break, the break text uh, is so still on. You realize oh, that Gorm has you in a chokehold. Uh, he may not be able to oh. take another step. He has taken his step and he has stopped, but he whispers he into your words. ear, Jean-Claude, release me and I will walk away. I'm going to twist one more time. I'm going to twist one more time. Oh, yeah, you're good. Better. You're better. Give up your last twist. 21 for acrobatics. Throw it in the old cauldron over there. Oh, no, oh. give it to <laughs> you. You asked for it the last time. <laughs> this is also confusing. I'm going to just read the stat block, make sure that I'm not missing anything. Um, you turn and you're able to slip out at the last second 
breaking free of the chokehold. He reaches for you, but his turn is ended as the platform underneath you, him disappears, and he, ah! And because he's <laughs> falling next to a tile that still exists, he can make a saving throw. Oh, it's so good to endeavor to hang That's on. Definitely huge. have silver bars. Any spells? He definitely prepared silver. I bars. just, I just randomly to the, spells. to the same tile that you're standing on. Oh shit. Um. If he moves five feet down as he falls. Can I opportunity to react, attack him and kick no, his hand? No. Damn it! He's, he, okay. he manages to grab on. Wow! To, he Just can't checking. take another step. He can't do anything, but he's doing everything that he can to survive. A tenacious survivor like him having made it this far, he is hanging on. And you look down and you have the dizzying height of the impossible scenario that you find yourself in, John Claude. He is still hanging on. Release me. Release me. Please! And that'll be the conclusion of Gorham's turn, Babar. Is that, is that, is that Babar B. Babar from the 42nd Grand Fleen Flow Prime Material Plane Championship? <laughs> yes, I think that is. He's playing a very tactical game. I'm not sure why he isn't attacking the others like the others are attacking the others. Very interesting. John Luke. So, I come to, if I swap my spell and drop concentration on haste, oh, then the horse is stuck. And I don't care. It's incapacitated. Incapacitated. Yeah. Horse uh, screwed anyway. Uh, <laughs> I will, I'll look down and I'll say, you are always worthless, Kevin. And I <laughs> <laughs> will jump off of the horse, uh, ending my concentration on haste. It'll be stunned and paralyzed. Um, I think it's still up, though. I need, to, I need to use an action. I don't know. It's still so. It's still gonna try to run in different, different directions. I guess depending. It's gonna run. No, it's gonna run it. Oh, do you have the do you have your token though? Oh, I do. You well, need to actually, that. also, is, even if it's in capped, it, the second you end your turn, all that will fall. It'll just plummet. It'll oh yeah, 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 yeah. So he's yeah. fucked. Yeah, he's yeah. fucked. So uh, I will jump in. Uh, you always were useless, Kevin. And now I will say, I will utter foul words and cause the, the worst thing you could possibly hear. The only thing that's inescapable and certain are death and taxes. That's right. As I cast Summon Lesser Demons. Oh my god. As I will slap my hands together and once again create a summoning circle. As I'm going to roll 1d6 to see the demon summoned, and it's up to Derek to choose how the demons manifest. Oh, Jesus. Uh, I'm sorry. May I start Xing these off? This is going to take me a while. Are you, yeah. Are, yeah. Is there anything that's yeah. going to happen with the, okay. I just want to make sure. Um, summon what? Four demons of challenge rating of uh, one half or lower. No, I need this spell. What, what? are you, you casting? Oh, uh, summon lesser, uh, summon lesser demons. Thank you. I just want to see my options. Uh, four demons of challenge Rating half or lower is what you got? Uh, yes, one half or lower. They're hostile to all creatures, including you. Oh, great. Roll initiative for the summon demons as a group. Uh, they pursue and attack the nearest non demons to the best of their ability. Where are they? Um, I can place it anywhere I'd like. So, what I'd like to do is. I like to place them in between Glitzy and the bar, hoping that they'll basically, hoping that they'll attack both of them. As I will, oh, actually, I'm gonna go in this direction. So all, by the way, all of these are tapped. Actually, can I, oh, I can run, I can run, I'm here. Choose your movement after yeah, Andy's yeah. done with what he's yeah. doing. There's a lot of platforms. Uh, 
Yeah, you hit. Now these were the walrus. Yep. This yeah. was our boy, the horsey. Jesus. And then his is just straight down those two. Yeah, lines. because you yeah, went through moved. and around. Okay, where's your movement? So I will have jumped off. Yep. So that's five, yep. 10, 15, 20, 25. No, yes, yes, you're good, you're good, you're good. 30. Yep, 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 you're good. And so I'm going to summon the demons. Uh, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. In between Babar and Kletzi. When do they show up? They show up immediately. I mean, when do they uh, move? Uh, they roll initiative. Oh. So they're hostile to everyone, including me. As part of the action, though, I can create a circle that prevents me from their gaze. Jesus. And I'll put the circle around me. Is it just five feet? It's five feet. Okay. Five feet Do you want any of them touching Babar or Glitzy uh, or just in the middle, like randomly scattered? How would you like to pl pl place them? Uh, Do you roll how many you summon? I rolled, yes, four demons of challenge rating one half or lower. Okay. The DM chooses the demons. Yep. Oh, I can choose the unoccupied spaces yeah, that I can see. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so you can put them, that's, uh, okay. Yeah. All of Damn a sudden it. there's this loud infernal bang and you all smell the the um, <clears throat> impossible, oh, almost like ozone toxicity, toxicity of the abyss. And a, a, after a brilliant um, fiendish light, these Four, uh, they almost look like pig-faced, uh, uh, hairless apes, uh, land down, long, thick ears, uh, uh, disgusting green skin, uh, as four dretches suddenly, uh, emerge out of nothingness, having been transmogrophilosophized by jean No, he's no, holding on. He's, he's holding he's, on he's like, to He's like hanging on to the ledge. Yeah. Is that the conclusion of your turn? That's my turn. Wild Ruth. All of a sudden, you've watched all of these uh, uh, panels uh, evaporate and disappear. Um, it is getting sketchy. Can these demons fly? They cannot. Awesome. <laughs> Fuck you, demon. <laughs> How's uh, Jean-Luc looking? <laughs> like a bitch. <laughs> not good. Like it's a not, bitch? It's not good. <laughs> I'm not sure who I'm rooting for, to be honest. I uh, I just want everyone to have a nice time. This is uh, violent. <laughs> I'll go this way so that Sorry, where did you start? So I started here. Okay. So I did just... this, this, and oh, then okay. that. <clears throat> you can X off the squares yeah. that I did. Should just be those. Yep. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Uh, so if he wants to make an opportunity attack, he can. Uh, and. Uh, oh, the demon can. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We don't have any idea how many HP these demons have. Oh, they're dretches. <laughs> they shouldn't be too strong, right? I mean, you don't want to tell me that. But I just tell a that. Dretch they're one half. They're, yeah, the dretches are. I can't imagine hard. they have a lot of HP. They came in like a dretching ball. <laughs> <laughs> he would say that. <laughs> that was a very him thing to say. <laughs> They're very strange. They move around like a squirrel with three tails. Confusing but entertaining. Uh, I'm going to, uh, my hand will glow again and the ice will glow blue and I'm going to shoot uh, Rhymes Binding Ice. <laughs> yeah, let's get <laughs> Sean <have> Luke. <clears throat> he needs to make a uh, con save. So he's pretty good at that. So we'll I see. Say, I say a con save. I say, I say a 19 <laughs> plus three. Oh, proficient in the, I'm proficient in those because of my Philosopher Stone. So Jeez. plus six, 25. So you take. Eight, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. You take 10 points of uh, cold damage. Well, I say, I say, I say the walrus, he might have a quick whip, but in a battle of brawn, he couldn't rip up your baby picture. <laughs> I say. <laughs> I say. He says. I say, I say, is there a loophole? <laughs> <laughs> yeah! <laughs> all, the, all the demons disappear. Oh, 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 oh,
Yeah. No way. Yeah, all oh, the demons. Oh, so we got to mark their spaces, I presume. Yeah, you just have to mark their spaces. It was here, 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 and. Yep. No, you got it first. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, and they'll go when the threat shifts. So you're still unconscious, but you're. Yeah. But it's concrete and that's. Yeah. Um. We got him! Oh! What do we do now? I yell out. <laughs> but Bar looks at you with a with a with a like a a face that looks like it's carved from stone. He he looks conflicted. This is not the ruthless Babar that you're used to. Okay, that's good. What's what's Glitzy looking? Does Glitzy say anything in this moment? Oh fuck that guy. Okay. Okay. <laughs> hmm. Uh, I I will hold on to my bonus action and just leave it at that. Jean Claude. <clears throat> oh, that's on full. Oh, oh, and, and my she, brother. And she would have said, <laughs> "Nice, nice job, the walrus. We got rid of that fuck." Um, please help me up. I will. I will protect you. Well, I say, I say, I say. Go on, mate. You've just, I've just assisted in felling my own brother. You think I give a damn about you? <laughs> yes, but your brother was a dick. Well, that's fair. Good point. I've seen what you do with those hands. I, I think it's worth your while. <laughs> I see. Uh, it, you stick a pole right there. Is that, 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 what, what do you want I me say, to do? I say, I say, I was born at night, but I wasn't born last night. <laughs> that's absolutely right. <laughs> Um, and you feel you could get away from him without uh, incurring an attack of opportunity. He has no Okay. Um, all the same, I'll slide him a Polaroid of him having a personal, intimate moment in the stalls. <laughs> um, and he will take, unless he's a gentleman of, uh, <laughs> you know, <laughs> unless he's a gentleman of not ill repute, then that will, you, you oh, decide he get? that's it. <laughs> um, and he, he will, any roll that he attempts to make, I'll have to take a 1d8 away from it. Uh, and I'll say, well, I say, I say, I say, go on, you know what, I will drop concentration, but only to do this! Uh, and I flap my chicken wings as hard as I can, because I am now the correct Aarakocra, and I cast <laughs> Gust of Wind! Yeah! And a blast of pillar of wind erupts from my flapping, uh, righteous wings. Do you end suggestion? Do you have to? What is concentration? Yeah. Oh, okay. So I'll end suggest. I mean, he's done what I've suggested he do. He's yeah. in his spot. It's yeah. over. And he hasn't moved. So I will end suggestion there. Okay. To now concentrate on a okay. massive pillar of wind that is blasting the, 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 the Polaroid angle. flaps away from his hand, yeah. and he holds on with both hands as best he can. Uh, that so he will. Strength saving throw. It is, I believe, Minus a strength idea. saving. Throw. What's the DC? Well, he might not have to do it till his turn. I'm gonna let me. Um, so it's concentration, a line of strong wind, 60 feet long and 10 feet wide, but yeah. I'm going to try and blast it down into his square. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, choose the spell duration. Uh, each creature that starts its turn in the line must succeed on a strength saving throw or be pushed 15 feet uh, away yeah. uh, deep down. Uh, in the direction of following the line, any creature that attempts, if he were to, like, if he could successfully climb out of it, it would eat a large chunk of his movement. Mm. Uh, if, if he has any flames on him, it's extinguished. Um, uh, uh, and I move my movement to the corner of the room. That's smart. Okay. Uh, take six steps towards. But the you're car. not. You're flying though, so you're. You're not triggering. Yeah, I am. I don't know. If oh, that, are you flying? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You wouldn't be triggering the tiles if, without putting pressure on them. So remove the tiles for me, and it can fucking go. Oh, apologies. I, I got it here. Um, just you, when you, you land, you do, at not, the you end. do not touch the tiles. Oh, uh, just yeah. when you yeah. land. Yeah. And if he yeah, flew here you too, have to you land. Have to, you've got to be able to land. You have to oh, land, did right? you fly to that other location? He flew here too, so I don't think these would be touched either. Well, he started here. Right. So that would be touched. No, that, that, that one's that supposed was, to that was that was has to land. land. But these three... Well, it would, I mean, it doesn't say that I have to land, it just says that I fly. If you don't have the hover, then you can't stay in the air. Got it. Okay, okay, I okay. believe. Okay. Okay. I, so yeah. there's a tile Where behind... That is... That is... Yes. Okay, I'm going to increase the DC a lot, but we'll see if he can survive the wind and God. potentially grab we, onto the other. You kill this guy. <laughs> there's a Polaroid of him enjoying an intimate moment. It's, it's, it's my body. What we're down learning the is that Jean-Claude's real crime is not all the jury damage shit. You're a peeping Tom. 
<laughs> yeah. That's how you're you getting these photos. Yeah. Uh, this guy's yeah, in the see. privacy of his own home, and you're taking pictures of him doing lewd <laughs> shit. <laughs> To win a court case, you need everything on your side. The law and a bunch of other criminal activity. Let's see, you're up. Yeah, you don't need a criminal lawyer. You need a criminal lawyer. Um, it's a great one. It's all good, man. Well, I can fly, too. You can. I'm yeah. a fairy. Oh. Um, but I'm not gonna. And so I'm gonna move along the line that I had walked on previously. No, along the line I blocked on previously. And then, no, back one. There, so that should be three, and then three. Nope, and then over. Oh, uh, oh. X off John Claude's two pips for me while we're, while we're talking. Oh, this one and that yeah. one. Yeah, yeah. And I'll need to quickly roll for for him, uh, he does fall to his death. <laughs> <laughs> what does that sound like? <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, <sorry>. oh, oh, <laughs> oh! Oh my god, there's spikes down here! <laughs> 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 Let's see, you done? Uh, yeah, that's my turn. <sighs> <laughs> now, uh, mark off the uh, dredge pits as their turn is over. And Babar. <coughs> Do we decide? Uh, had, did you ever cast a bonus action spell on an action spell in the same turn? I did. I use five feet of movement. Thirty. Mm -hmm. I can bonus action misty step. Yes. Then I have 10, 20, 30, 40. Sorry. I used five. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. I raise my hand, and with the most solemn <laughs> face I've ever had in my life, I close it as I channel my divine energy and I begin to cast Hold Person. <gasps> you have to make a wisdom saving throw. You don't have any twits either. And it's, it's just plus zero. Let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see. Let me see. I mean, it's probably out of no reason. Oh, the brother's gonna yeah, go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't touch my dice. Oh my god. <laughs> what is it? It's a nine. nine, and I say, you should have been a better attorney. <laughs> oh, no! As you are now paralyzed for the duration. Oh my god. How long a is what? the duration? Is a minute. A minute? <gasps> Goodbye! Do you have any any ability to save against it, or? At the end of your next turn. Okay. With which the tile will have fallen, <laughs> and you will be gone. Well, it will be simultaneous. It falls at the end of my next turn. You will not have any movement. But would I have the same opportunity to catch oh. the tile? Maybe. Yeah. Maybe. Perhaps. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And you got wings. Yeah. That is, is the end of Bad Bar's turn. Fucking brutal. Oh my god. You almost see it. You see what looks like there might be a tear in Bad Bar's eye, but you're not sure. Oh. You're not sure. Glitzy oh, looks far. between Bad Bar and John Claude. I, I, I mean, I, I, I guess, right? He wasn't one of the three. He wasn't with us in the last game, so if one of us has got to go, I guess I'm sorry, John Claude, I'm sorry. This is really very sad. I'm not sure exactly what to say. <gasps> say whatever's in your heart, Tank. Uh, that's your turn, uh, John Luke. Shit. Am I able to use twists on death saving throws? I don't see why not. Damn! Okay. Okay. But, okay. Hold on, I'll be right back. Oh, okay, should I not roll? No, you can roll. Did I'm you ice him at all? 
I'm gonna twist. Like even no, if he I survives say, I his, save. okay, because well, he's doing death saving throws. Now though, no. No, I just did damage. Not uh, I'm out. going to twist. He's, he's trying to fish for a natural twenty. I'm fishing 20. for a natural twenty. <laughs> oh yeah, because you got to get up and move. Yeah. I'm gonna use all my twists. Yeah, I mean you got to. Might as well. Keep an eye on him so you cheat. Just be aware. Thank you, won't, you, chat. You won't have them for. That's fine. Yeah, I mean if you're gonna fucking okay. live, you gotta live. He, I think he really likes computer. playing this evil re-roll. transmutation. I, I was going to re-roll that one. Hit your computer. <laughs> no, roll, roll, roll it out no. here. Roll it out here. <laughs> oh <my laughs> uh, one last one. That's no, it? Uh, I got one no, more no, twist after that. He's got one. He's got one. Okay. Okay, this is it. The last oh twist. God. I love that you're doing this. I'm going to use part of the cards here. Oh no. my god, I saw the 19 oh, and I, I like, my blood ran cold. I succeed. <laughs> you succeed. But not with a 20. <laughs> you Is have one successful turn? death saving That's throw, it. but at the end of your turn, you are unawares as the panel no, underneath you disappears, okay. and all of a sudden you are Jeez. plummeting. You. Um, I say, I say, I'm sorry, brother. <laughs> Uh, you as I'm paralyzed out of the core of my eyes. You have my eyes are like this. You have two moments. Like, you, you have the moment of falling unconscious initially, as all this damage uh, uh, hit you over and over and over after your uh, outrageous initial um, sprint onto the battlefield. And as you are plummeting, I would say that you do finally find that natural twenty and wake up just in time to hit the ground below. What are you Jesus. thinking? <laughs> oh, yeah, that is far. <laughs> That's far. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll say just say. in time. Oh, oh fuck! My only what? regret is I got hit by all those ice spells. <laughs> <laughs> and you do find that there are spikes, oh. Prince oh. of Persia style, at the bottom of this pit. That's John Luke. The walrus's turn. What a good, what a good oh, song, Jane. Oh God, no! <laughs> Baboro, could you? I just, I, I'm focusing on the spell and I look to you. And I have, I just have again, my phone, my face looks like it's carved from stone. I, I look stoic, I look uh, displeased, but I don't look as vengeful as you normally see me. You were my brother! <laughs> You're the chosen one! <laughs> From my point of view, the tusks are evil. <laughs> So that's falling. You're trapped, man. No, I can, I can teleport. Oh. Yeah, we both have Misty Step. Oh, oh yeah. You have Face Step, too. Yeah, that's what I'm using. So I... So how, how do we win? Just be the last three alive? As soon as the third next person dies, the game should presumably end. Because the last that one is was correct. Good. Even presumably. though he's going to try to take me out over here. Look at this. He's ca- calculating 120 fucking squares. So that's one square of movement. Then one, two. So theoretically, I'm gonna yeah, say yeah, here. Just but calculate it out. One. Five feet of movement. Five and then if I can misty step, one and a half, two and a half, three and a half, four and a half, six. Yep. Yep. And then I have five feet of movement left. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. And then if I have a sixty foot spell, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh! Oh my god! I'll yep. allow it. Cause those are the rules of the game. <laughs> <gasps> I'm coming! I'm coming, Freebird! <laughs> Hold on! Hold on! That's amazing. Let's go! I don't think the walrus realizes what we're doing here. No, he doesn't seem to appreciate that everyone's gonna die for the sake uh, of godhood. Do you He's wanna trying to save his, his friends spot. for some yeah. sort of twisted vision of so his walrus justice. Here? So you landed and there. And then you have five, ten, fifteen, twenty, and that was your twenty-five. Yeah, and then those three need five. to be crossed out. They, yeah, because they'll, they'll be gone at the end. That Thank you, amazing. Andy. Um, okay. No, thanks for keeping me on top of it. You know, from a certain point of view, the X'd out like, area all looks kind of like a chicken, like a pixelized like chicken icon to me. Maybe it's just from my perspective. Oh, yeah! I see the beak, it's eyes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see, yeah. You're as, right. as I have, the, as I have uh, Jean-Claude in my grip, from a, from a distance, I see the walrus coming in and I say, The walrus! No! Stop! <laughs> you, you don't understand! We cannot all survive! 
I am doing what must be done, Dolores. We can find a way. There's got to be a way. You are a naive fool. The walrus might need to go. That's very oh. funny. That's <laughs> the, the walrus the entire time is, is impossible. Hey, I'm respectful. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're st- uh. <laughs> Thank you for all the twists that I wasted on my like, saving throw, but I appreciate you guys. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Okay, I gotta try this. <laughs> walrus win! <laughs> I'm going to guess. And from Jean Luc's para, Jean Claude's paralyzed body, a wave with a bunch of walruses will start to Badass. flow and crash into Babar. Uh, he needs to oh make a. God. I'm going to use so many twists. Uh, <laughs> it's a deck save 16. Oh, wow. That's well, you picked one that I suck at. I thought it was going to be a wave of water called Walrus Rave, but it's actually a wave of Walry. Oh, you're good. I got a 24. I have a plus so, 6 to save. A 48. Could you 48 one more D8? 48 is a lot. Would you like one of mine? I would like one of yours. I don't know if this is a conflict of interest. It's not. <laughs> One, two, three, four, uh, 10, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 points. So it's still 10. I have to save four, right? Not more than 10? Correct. Your okay. concentration but I am is taking. Ten. I'm taking half of 19? Yes. Or I take the full amount? You take eight points of, eight points of. And I will save for concentration. My con save is okay. plus seven. I need to use the 10. Come on, come on, come on. I'm gonna use a twist, because that would be a nine. Okay, okay, okay. I have to just not roll ones, twos. Yeah. Yeah, anything higher than a... Oh, okay. I saved well, my concentration. Oh, the walrus! <laughs> stop this nonsense! Open your eyes and realize that I'm trying to save you! <laughs> I see my oldest friend paralyzed on the ground. All of my magical walruses fall into the pit. Well, it's not over yet. We got to see what happens here. Cause How would you like to do this, Derek? So you have to, at the end of your turn, you are allowed to oh, make yeah. the save again. Yeah. But what it says is that you are paralyzed for the duration, and you just make another wisdom saving throw. On a success, the spell ends on the target. So, yeah, that's it. I mean, you won't oh. be able to move or anything, but you will save for it, and then it's up to the DM to determine whether or not you can grab on. Save for it. If you succeed, I'll walk. I'll walk through the steps. If you succeed, then you will have a moment's reaction as you pass down, because the you got three to grab. The platform that you're standing on disappears at the end of your turn. At the same time, at the moment that you maybe are able to free yourself and suddenly have locomotion again, you'll start to drop. At that moment, you might be able to reach out and maybe grab on. To, I think people are getting uh, platform. Yeah, right. we need to check to see if we don't have Re- more twists. Real quick, can I? If oh, I can use a bonus action on my turn, and that's okay. If you misty stepped, isn't that the bonus action? It is. Thank you. I appreciate that. Then you can hold on. So that'll be a DC 15 <laughs> dexterity saving throw to fuck me. <laughs> after you try to succeed from the whole person. If none of this happens, then you simply fall to your doom and you get to enjoy a death moment. Yeah. Make sure though, though, that nobody has given us five twists total. Yeah. So that Mace, guys, Mace might get an extra. Oh, so hold well, on. I can roll without. We, we start. We're seeing if we. We were seeing if we have twists. We have. Because you allotted your twists. Thank we you have so Canadian much. Tech Priest. We have Smeet. What was 500 across mm-hmm. all of these? Thank you. We have. That's another one between across all three of those. Thank you. Oh my so God. That's we got 100 100? bits. Okay. Uh, there's two more. So yeah, you got. We got an extra twist. We got a twist. We got another one from Otaku, thank, thank you. you. Another, another one from Smee. Smee, not you. Smee, not so you. we are two away from a full, d- although you're dead. I so still get it. Is it the player? Yay! Oh, okay. still get oh, the player. Yeah, I, I will, not the, not the I will right. roll uh, the save with one twist. Just with ownership of one twist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See if you pass first. It's not like crazy high. You'll, what, what is this? What's it? It's 15. I was yeah, going to tell you. Wisdom. Yeah, wisdom. Got it. Oh, okay. yeah. Until I just you... meant what, like wisdom. Oh, yeah, 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 it's yeah, wisdom. rough, buddy. Do yours. Okay. You I'll use my one twist. He's, He's going to cash twist. in his twists. His twists. Who's different die. Who's are all these? Yeah, that, oh, that, those, that, are those are all Those are all Mike's spent ones. And then this is Mace's spent one. Nope. It's a seven. Was it meant to be? I fail. You have, you have, well, did you just get, 
You used, yeah. used his twist. I used it. Yeah. Used it. It was a five and then a seven. It wasn't meant to be. That bar tightens his grip as you feel your bones and muscles tighten even further as you are unable to get away from the grip of the browser. You drop 500 feet in what feels like no time at all. You are unable to fly. You are unable to uh, do anything. All that you have left for these few moments before you hit the spikes at the very bottom of this chasm is uh, what you think to yourself before the end. May I have final words? That's what I'm asking you to do, yeah. Can I have vocal final words? Sure. I, as I'm, my bones are crunching, I'm paralyzing. I, I, my one chicken eye opens to the side, and I look towards the walrus and I say, I say, I say, my real brother, this chicken is blocked. As I plummet, as I plummet. Oh, I say, I say my final foot! But the moment that he passes through the threshold of that opening, you feel the ground underneath you solidify. It suddenly, all of the fallen panels and everything underneath you uh, restores itself to the point where you need not fear where you're standing. You do not need to keep moving. All of a sudden, uh, it becomes a safe space once again uh, for the three of you, the walrus, Glitzy, and Bar, to stand. The moment the ground solidifies, that bar will double over, hands on knees, one hand on the wall next to him, and he begins to breathe heavily. <sighs> 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 I'm just like sobbing. I'm on the ground. <laughs> My brother! Oh, free bird! <laughs> to the one of the walls. This is so fucked doors, up. Doors open. And uh, two, three, four sets of uh, pyramid headed uh, constructs, guardians, sentinels walk in, and you know that you're being led, guided to. The dormitory. The right moment there. that they come in, and do they try to like, like, touch us or grab us or take us? They, no, they don't. They don't try to like grab you by the arms or anything. They just uh, create an opening, and just by their very body language, just as we walk past them, that bar is is radiating heat and anger. And as he gets closer, he says, "Fuck you, fuck all of you. When I win this, I'm coming back for all of you." And I proceed to the dormitory. You continue to walk through. You said that to the pyramid head. Yes. Oh, okay. I was like, shit. <laughs> They'll have to drag me out. I'll be like <laughs> sobbing and screaming and wailing and slamming on the door. <laughs> <laughs> as I fall, as I fall and I plummet. Yeah. <laughs> I run over to this corner and I'm like clawing at the ground that just solidified. They, they grab you underneath the arms eventually and pull you, uh, uh, boots scraping against the. Uh, Fuck off me! I can walk myself! <laughs> uh, this is so messed up! One day more, Jean. We'll see each other Glitchy, again. Glitchy just looks around the room as, as uh, the walrus is being dragged out. God, he only had 30 more days. He <laughs> 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 Glitzy <laughs> is the uh, what's the the, the mall, not the mall rats movie the movie I wasn't supposed to be here. Yeah. 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 Glitzy yeah. is the clerks. <laughs> you all three of you eventually find your way back to the dormitory, oh. and you've realized that the beds have been cleared out. This entire uh, space has actually been almost decorated. Curtains hanging from the walls, tapestries. There are now um, uh, uh, tall um, candelabras in all directions. It's been made to look faux fancy, for it still is in this sort of uh, uh, hygienic space of uh, uh, um, un un uh, decoratedness. But in the center, uh, just underneath the treasure chest, there's a table a long banquet table, and you can see other people are beginning to assemble, and the voice above is not the announcers uh, that you've come to recognize from the Fleen Flow Championship, but the announcer of the front man. Please, sit down, assemble. It is time for your last meal. And that is where we'll call tonight's session. Oh! oh.